Let's get them both here, boy! <laughs> Fucking get shit wrecked. <laughs> Honestly, it's some. Hello, fine and wonderful people of the internet. Welcome back to Mass Effect. Hello. How is it going? I don't know why the fucking. I don't know why the fuck this ship is so loud. So, Mass Effect had the problem of being a little bit too quiet, but uh, Mass Effect 1, that is. But Mass Effect 2 seems to be a whole different girl loud. So, um, yeah, welcome in everybody. Um, we're going to be doing some Mass Effect today. Over the last couple of days, we have been doing some GTA. Not some GTA. Hello there. Hey, Duke, how you doing? How you feeling today, Chief? Um, I do need to stop the camera from being problematic in nature. Um, I'm having to get used to uh, changing the camera settings quite regularly because... Uh, I got quite tired of the like the AI that steers the camera, just looking at my tits all the time, which was, you know, not terrifically beneficial. <laughs> so hey ho, it is what it is. Uh, a little bit better today. How are you? Yeah, I'm doing good, thank you. I'm doing good. Um, yeah, had a good stream yesterday. Got finished up at about <laughs> six o'clock in the morning. Actually, it was later than that, to be honest. It was about seven o'clock by the time I actually got to bed. Um, but no, we are we've got a nice sleep, nice and refreshed. It's now, it's now time to hit up some Mass Effect. Um, so in at the end of the last episode, we got familiar with our ship, the SS Normandy, SSV Normandy Two, and now we are going to go and um, we're going to go and see where we're going. So Omega-4 really is the one that we can use because it's problematic in nature. There's a field depot here. Whoa. I don't know. So have we explored this system? I've completely, I've completely fucking forgot how this works. So Omega's in the asteroid belt, that's fine. There's a planet here. Ooh, an unexplored planet. Enter orbit. Methane ammonia gas giant. Oh god, this is where you've got to do these things. I hate this thing, it's insufferable. Oh, hang on. Let's get some oh, platinum, baby! In research projects, platinum is used to upgrade sniper rifles, shotguns, and medical equipment. Your eyebrows are used to upgrade medical equipment. Fuck you. Oh, this place is quite good for platinum, actually. Fuck me! Probe away. Oh, yes, look at this bad boy. I was gonna say there's a good source of palladium somewhere. So this is so rather than driving around on uh, planets, which was fun and interesting, and you know you got a sense of like scale and adventure. No, in, in this you just kind of have to like cover uh, cover planets. There's some iridium here somewhere. Where is it? Launching probe. In research projects, iridium is used to upgrade heavy weapons, submachine guns, and assault rifles. Wow. Probe away. In research projects, palladium is used to upgrade heavy pistols, armor, and cybernetics. Okay, well, this planet is depleted. Depleted doesn't mean that there's no resources at all. It just means that, um... Uh, it just means that you can, uh, that there's not an abundance of resources. So we've bled that place fucking dry. 
so that so there's a gas giant here. I wonder if we might visit this tiny little planet here. George Ganner. Ooh, so this is mineral rich. Oh fuck yeah it is. Boop. Probe launched. Mm -mm -mm. Oh look at this Probe shit away. right here. I'm gonna actually have to replenish my probes before I can go on. I'm gonna have Probe more launched. I'm gonna have more platinum than I know what to fucking do with. Jesus Christ. Probe launched. Delicious, delicious mineral goodness. Okay, let's get some palladium then. So it's roughly in the equatorial belt. Probe we'll launched. fire that one here. Uh, we're out of probes. Yeah, okay, fine. Uh, right, I don't want to fill our bank. So because we, because we basically maxed out our character in two, uh, in one, sorry. Um, Oh yeah, look at this. Look. We can get can we get more probes? Oh yeah we can. Buy probes, 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 probes. Oh my god, probes are so fucking cheap. But we don't wanna we don't wanna max out. We don't want to max out, and the reason that we don't want to max out is that we don't want to um we don't want to fill our um stuff with nothing to spend it on. So let's go to Omega and well let's just let's just get the stream started and earnest, shall we? Let's go! So Omega is an asteroid world. It is where the seedy underworld of the galaxy doth do the lie. Go on, little Normandy. Well, it's actually quite a big Normandy now, to be honest. <laughs> uh, right, I've got no choice but to take uh, bitch face. Wait, can cycle appearance? Oh shit, I didn't know that was a thing. Okay. Uh, let's take Miranda and Captain Bland. Well, I'll, uh, yeah. Don't really have much of a fucking choice in it. Uh, oh, I've got. Oh, I do have. Uh, um. Ammo's a bit interesting, so I just. Mm, I do wonder. I do actually wonder if operative might be what I want. Most. Um, let's go. Let's go with operative three. So that basically gives me. Um, it basically gives me more sniping buffs, more damage, and more health. Which, given that this is fucking insanity, is uh, well going to be useful. So bitch face doesn't have anything to spend, nor does Captain Bland. Bang it. So let's uh, let's go. Welcome to Omega. Hey, how you doing? Welcome to Omega. You're new here, aren't you? I can always tell. Allow me to... Welcome to Terry. Oh, hello, Mocklin. I was just... Leave, Fargot. Now. Oh, of course, Mocklin. Whatever she wants. <laughs> Blasted scavengers. Welcome to Omega, Shepard. Hmm, well, you know who I am? Oh, of well. course. We had you tagged the moment you entered the Terminus systems. You're not as subtle as you think. Your mother's Mario not subtle, wants fuck to you. Know what brings a dead Spectre to Omega. I suggest you go to Afterlife now and present yourself. Yeah, alright. I'll keep that in mind. Afterlife, now. Listen here, you. I'll fucking shoot your eyelids. I'm receiving quarantine warnings about the slums where Dr. Morton Solis runs the clinic. <laughs> Anticipate resistance at the transport station. Delightful. Respectable. Hey, Epic Polar Bear, how's it going? What that? What, what? Look, I know what a map is. You don't have to fucking. Boo. Right, let's go see a lot of area. Please. Oh, wait, Zaid's here? Shut it. Interesting. Oh, my. So, Zaid is a recruitable bean. Let's see if he is. Please. You have to help me. No one said you could talk, jackass. You Zaid Masani? <laughs> yeah, that's me. 
You must be Commander Shepard. Hey, we have a galaxy to save. Hmm, interesting. How do you hear such things? I assume you've been briefed. I've done my homework. Cerberus sent me everything I needed to know. Excellent. Who the fuck's your friend? My contacts told me we're picking up one man, not two. Batarian delinquent. Pissed off someone rich enough to hire me to go after him. And for my bring him in alive rates, even. <laughs> I didn't do it. I said, <laughs> shut it. Mm, Tried to boot to the face. All over the systems. You should have known better. These people always want to Omega. <laughs> Respectable. All right. Go ahead and get set up on the Normandy. Right. I'll go make myself at home. Mm, now you shout. Oh. I assume the elusive man told you about our arrangement. Uh, no, he did not. No. I guess he decided to leave that information out of the dossier. Good thing I asked. Ah. Picked up a mission a little while back, just before I signed on with Cerberus. Thought you might be interested. You heard the name Vito Santiago? He's the head of the Blue Suns. Runs the whole organization. Cool. Seems he recently captured an Elfell Ashland refinery on Zoya and is using their workers for slave labor. The company wants it dealt with. Yeah, we can do that. I'll make sure we get that done. Good. Get it out of the way so we can concentrate on being big goddamn heroes. Mr. Mr. Missani, why do I feel that your uh, heart's not in it? I better turn this thing in before it starts to stick. I'll be locked in. Ah, the next time you're ready to get some killing done. Good shit, Zaid. Good fucking shit. Right. Okay. Fine. So let's open the door. Yes! This is the fucking, uh, this is the fucking uh, Elcor Bouncer. I fucking love the Elcor Bouncer. So basically, for those of you who watched the Mass Effect 1 series uh, streams, uh, you'll be familiar with just how much I fucking love the Elcor. They have a special place in my heart because I struggle with communicating with people uh, on account of I don't always get the right gist of what they're saying. And that's basically the Elcor in a nutshell. So they always, uh, they always talk about what they are, um, what they are going, like, the reason that they are going to say something right before that they say it. Um, and, uh, yeah, you'll probably, and, and the Elcor bouncer is, uh, is, is pretty funny. Come on, Alcar. Give me the good stuff. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's good shit. You've let ten people in while I've been standing here. <laughs> I honestly fucking love the Alcar. So for those of you who might not see, uh, who, who might not see, uh, who might not seen Mass Effect before, we've got a good old alien jamboree going on right here. So we've got one of them humans, we've got one of them Elcars who we just introduced. This here is a Turian. This here be a Batarian, a Salarian here, and then over here, rather in the dark for some reason, we do uh, we do have the uh, we do have the Asaris as well. And then that's a Turian with a hat. So uh, let's go see area. Hey, how you doing? Can I come in? Cool. Wait, what the fuck's a Kylan? Oh, is he the dude who? No. No, that was uh, more, more, more. Fuck, I forgot his name already. Hey, friend, how you doing? What are you looking at? Whoa, careful now. Don't you have something better to do than pick fights with people you don't know? No, just the ones who get in my face. Well. Just see my gun. Do you really want to do this? I... Fine. <laughs> the hook. For now, see you around. Bye, Zs! Okay, so talking to him was maybe a mistake. Uh, I've never played through the Mass Effect series, but I downloaded the Legendary Edition start the first game yesterday. The launcher... The launcher is a bit of an ass, to be perfectly honest with you. The first game... So, truth be told, Polar Bear, um... The first game, I am almost alone in thinking that that is one of the strongest in the series. Two and three do have better mechanics, 
Um, I personally think that two has the one of the well. I don't know. I'm not. Yeah, I. My, my personal favorite in the series is number one, frankly. But uh, yeah, I do hope you enjoy it. I do hope you enjoy it. Where are Oh my. Oh my. Welcome to the strip club. Oh, this is loud. This is actually legitimately like nightclub loud. Bottle of brandy? Yeah, let's get fucking shipwrecked, boy. No, but let's talk to the bartender. Oh well, apparently we are getting shipwrecked because I misclick. I fucking love the idea that drink comes in these just fucking test tube things. I just drink it like an absolute odds and just get that right down my throat. Mm. Oh well. Talking is a luxury. So yeah. Got the Sari doing the Sari things. Um, right, so who can we talk to? We can talk to a Merc recruiter. He might have some idea of things. Oh. The private room is locked. Well, okay, you're busy. Fuck you too, cunt. <gasps> Helena Blake! Oh yes! So hang on, let me let me turn this off so you can hear me for a wee second. Um Helena Blake. Helena Blake we saw in the last or second last stream of Mass Effect. Um so she is somebody who uh we were going to arrest and uh we decided not to because I didn't feel that she'd done anything wrong yet. She was going to but here she is, right in front of us. Let's go tickle her pickle, let's go. Commander Shepard, is that you? I I'd heard you were dead. I'm Helena Blake. We met a few years ago. I oh, I remember you, remember. bitch. You removed two criminal warlords from power and persuaded me to retire. I'll never forget it. Yeah. What brings you to Omega? What brings anyone to Omega? Opportunity, success, failure. All of the above. Well, crime I usually. This place suits me. I can bring it a certain air of civility, I suppose. Oh, awesome. I have to go. Good to see of you. Course. You must have more important things to do. Good to see you're not dead. Uh, right, let's six. Oh my god. So this is Lower Afterlife, this is a separate part of the club. Boogie down! Yeah, I, I ain't dancing with a motherfucking grenade launcher on my back. That's a Blue Suns mercenary there. Ah, oh, dude, fuck. I mean, I'm in, am I in Gangland? I think I am. Yeah, so there's a, there's a running theme in the game that um, Shepard is like a shit dancer. Like, we're not we're not watching somebody with their boobies out. Where the fuck do these places go? What the fuck? Is this all? Uh, nope, we're not dealing with this. <laughs> We'll go for an explore later, that's what we'll do. Let's go see if there's anyone interesting in the VIP room, though. So. Uh, nobody interesting here. Patriarch? You were right to come to me. I could talk to Arlia for you myself. No. You said he had close family. He'll just want revenge. Kill the family first. Then, if you get angry, go back to stupid. Oh, Krogan. <laughs> Hey, how you doing? I think I know you, human. I'm the Patriarch. Arius Patriarch. What do you want? Hmm. What do you 
know about Aria? Everything. A few centuries ago, Omega was my rock. When Aria arrived, she had nothing but the clothes on her back. Oh, it got usurped. Another dancer. She killed half my men and convinced the rest that she could run this place better than I did. So you became a bitch. One of my hearts shattered half the bones of my body and <laughs> left me alive. What the hell? What made her decide to leave you alive? Oh, she doesn't destroy what she can use. She said I could have all my old comforts if I served as her advisor. Krogan bitch. I know who to lean on, who to smack down, who to smile at. <laughs> and everyone who respected me saw me beaten, broken. They knew that as strong as I'd been, she was stronger. Wow. Why do they call you Patriarch? It's like an Asari matriarch, only males. She was Arya's little joke. After she took me down, she let me live. Kept me around as an advisor. And a trophy. A Krogan as old as you must have some great stories. I killed a lot of people. Lived well and was beaten by his <laughs> my time is done. Anyone I killed is long forgotten. I should be going. Okay, well that was Patriarch. Uh, let's talk to Farvin, whoever the fuck this is. Hey how you doing? Apparently he's just a bartender. Cool. Cool, cool. Right, let's head. Uh, let's head back and let's let's go. Let's go introduce ourselves. Oh. I like um the thing. The thing about Mass Effect Two, right? This actually feels like a proper nightclub. Where if you feel like, uh, well, I guess Flux. Flux wasn't so. Flux wasn't good. Chorus Den felt like more of a nightclub, but um, Flux definitely just felt like. Meh. All right, let's talk to you. Anto. Arrangeable. Well, she's certainly got enough, uh, got enough guns. Hired guns, that is. All right, let's go say hi to Aria. That's close enough. Wow. <laughs> Now we head not, we head not. If you're looking for weapons, you're not doing a very good job. <laughs> too careful with dead specters. That could be anyone wearing your face. <laughs> I was told you're the person to talk to if I have questions. They're clean. Apparently so. Depends on the questions. You run Omega? I'm gonna assume that's a yes. Wait, what the music? What the fuck? But you need more. Everyone needs more something, and they all come to me. Well, excellent. I'm the boss, CEO, queen. If you're feeling dramatic, it doesn't matter. Omega has no titled ruler, and only one rule. How can you be the boss, the CEO, and the queen if there's no fucking ruler? What the fuck? Don't fuck with Aria. Arrangeable. Simple enough. I like it. Easy to remember. If you forget, someone will remind you. And then I toss your sorry ass out the nearest airlock. Well, it's fine. It's already happened once. It won't happen again. Dude, why just say the fucking furthest possible casually? So, what can I do for you? Uh, let's find out more about this thing. So you must know what's what on Omega. Everything that's worth knowing. I don't usually give it out freely. Information is power. Mundane things you can find yourself. <laughs> she is pretty badass, right? Like she is. Back alley or buy one of the mercs a drink. Better yet, talk to the entertainers. <laughs> they give great tours. Just don't waste my time. Wow. Well. Well, I know why she's indifferent, because she's a bitch, and she's a bitch, I don't want to listen to her, so... I'm trying to track down Archangel. 
You and half of Omega. You want him dead too? Why is everyone after him? He thinks he's fighting on the side of good. There is no good side to Omega. Everything he does pisses someone off. It's catching up to him. <laughs> Just the kind of guy I'm looking for. <laughs> really? Well, aren't you interesting? Quite. You're gonna make some enemies teaming up with Archangel. I don't care. That's assuming you can get to him. He's in a bit of trouble right now. Oh? What kind of trouble? The local Merc groups have joined forces to take him down. Ha! They've got him cornered, but it sounds like they're having trouble finishing him off. Oh They've my. They've started hiring anybody with a gun to help him. Sounds like that might be our ticket in. They're using a private room for recruiting. Just over there. I'm sure they'll sign you up. Hmm. Excellent. What can you tell me about Archangel? Not as much as I'd like. He showed up here several months ago and started causing all sorts of problems. If you make your own laws, which everyone here does, he makes life difficult. He's reckless and idealistic. But he seems to know enough to stay clear of me. Fair enough. Uh, how are you even awake, Hibble? I heard you were streaming until 6 a.m. You should be in a, co in a, coma, in a coma right now. Uh, no, um, I, yeah, so I went to bed about 7 o'clock in the morning. Uh, and yeah, you know, plenty of time to sleep. You know, and here I am now. It's fine. Which Don't worry about after it. Archangel. Blue Suns, Eclipse, Blood Pack. They're Omega's major players. Unless they're at war, you'll never see them together. But one thing they hate more than each other is Archangel. <laughs> Excellent. I appreciate the help. See if you still feel that way when the Mercs realize you're here to help him. Meh, yeah, it's fine. What about Morden? I'm looking for Morden's solace. Do you know where I can find him? The Solarian Doctor? Last I heard, he was trying to help plague victims in the quarantine zone. I always liked Morden. He's as likely to heal you as he is to shoot you. Ha! Ah, I can respect can that. tell me about him? Used to be part of the Solarian Special Tasks group. He's brilliant and dangerous. Just don't get him talking. He never shuts up. If you really need to find him, take a shuttle to the quarantine zone. No guarantee they'll let you in, of course. Mm. Fair enough. Uh, wish you met up with us for our wee walk today. Yeah, Ralik, rem remember I did have surgery only a couple of uh, a couple of months ago, and uh, I'm not recovering so well, so uh, I can't really walk. So the very fact that it's a, <laughs> you know, it's a, it was a walk to the place that you were going meant that it, it wasn't for me. And uh, as I said to Diamond, I wasn't going to sit there and ask everybody to change their plans for me. So the easiest solution was just to sit out and to leave you guys to have a nice day. But uh. Uh, well, I hope it was a good time. 6 a.m., what the hell? Yeah, Duke, you were you were there. You were there at the start of the stream, were you not? Um, yeah, we uh, we took a wee bit of a break for half an hour, about half past four in the morning. Got back into the swing, uh, sorry, at four until half past four in the morning. Uh, and then uh, that was mostly just because the game was broken. Um, and then we got back into the swing of things and, uh, yeah, kept going until just after six. And I went to bed at seven. And there we go. Bob's your uncle. Yeah, no, no, not at the end. Yes. Just try not to bring the plague back with you. No guarantees. Fuck you. Right, let's go talk to this Merc recruiter and see what's happening. I hear you're recruiting. Mm. Why don't you step inside? Quite. You'll get paid when the job's done, just like everyone else. Who's next? Hey, how you doing? Sweet. Oh, I will pop You're a, a pop place, a cat between your eyes. Surfers' quarters are that way. Mm. Wow, not even a smile. So you're here to fight then? Yep. Sure. If this is the place to go after Archangel. This is the place. Standard fee is 500 credits each. You get paid when the job's done. If you die, your friends don't collect your share. <laughs> you need your own weapons and armor. Looks like you got that covered. Don't and adjust. no, this does not make you a member of the Blue Suns, Eclipse, or the Blood Pack. You are a freelancer, period. Arrangeable. Any questions? Uh... Why are the Mercs working together to take down Archangel? You haven't been on Omega long, huh? No. He does everything he can to screw us. No, I have us. not. Shipments go missing. Operations are compromised. Every month it gets worse. Tarek and the other bosses are tired of losing credits. And men. Fair enough. Uh, I left at midnight. 60 a.m. is dedication. I'm impressed. Yeah. Well, the thing, uh, the thing about um, the thing about the role play is that you can really, really get into it. And with it being American Pacific time, 
um it's you kind of have to be up late if you're going to do like a proper night session of it which i've come to quite like doing um so so yeah is he a heavy hitter so yeah it was uh my my weekday yeah Tarek runs the blue suns but all three bosses are overseeing the operation right up jared's leading the eclipse and garms the head of the blood pack Tarek's in charge but the others would never say that I'm surprised they're in on this at all, but I guess getting rid of Archangel is worth it. <laughs> um, yeah, um, my weekday roleplay streams will not be that long or that late. <laughs> it's just the Friday, Saturday ones. Uh, right, what is, yeah, what's the plan what of attack? What do we do once we're there? How do we get to Archangel? The mercs will tell you when you get there. Last I heard, they were putting the freelancers into scouting groups. They attack in waves to distract Archangel while we try to get past his defenses. Oh, Archangel. <laughs> uh, okay. Where's the attack taking place? Archangel's base of operations. He's been hiding right under our noses. Ah. I can't tell you exactly where you're going, but we'll get you there. Arrangeable. Where do we go? Just head over to the transport depot outside the club. One of our boys will take you from there. Sign in the next one. Hey, is this where I sign up? You look a little young to be freelancing as a merc. I'm old enough. I grew up on Omega. I know how to use a gun. So does Archangel. I can handle myself. Besides, I just spent 50 credits on this pistol and I want to use it. <laughs> Get your money back. Hey, what are you... Trust me, kid. You'll thank me later. <laughs> it doesn't work. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> oh, look how sad he is. Oh, well, that's a butt crack. Um, aye, that's fair. I've had many situations where I'm ending up on a lot later than planned. Yeah, that's kind of the thing about... Um, <laughs> that's kind of the thing about roleplay. Uh, so so not, on, not only because you find yourself in situations, but actually... Um, there, there comes certain situations where you cannot just get up and leave from the role play because you would ruin experience for other people. Um, so th that didn't happen last night. Um, but January the first was a great example of that uh, because uh, it got to oh, it it got to about seven o'clock in the morning, um, and you know ev everything was fine. Uh, and then a wee bit of a strange incident happened at 7 o'clock in the morning that made me quite uncomfortable. Uh, and then I was left on my own, and we went back. I, I then made my way back to a nearby town. <laughs> I made my way back to a nearby town. And then this gang rode in and fucking took the entire town hostage, shot people, this, that, and the next thing. Um, and it was just this, like, incredibly intense situation. Uh, I didn't get robbed or killed on account of the fact that I was a student doctor at the time and I had to go help the doctor patch people up. Uh, and, and by the time I logged off and went to bed, it was half past nine in the morning. The sky was fucking, like, fully daylight again. I couldn't, uh, I couldn't believe it. So, um, so yeah. Oh, actually, let's, uh, yeah, let's go. Well, I'm pretty sure there's another way of, of doing it. But let's go, let's go to the, the arse end of the club. But yeah, it's one of those things of like, sometimes things happen in it that you just don't want to walk away from. And you end up being awake abusively late. I like there's no music all of a sudden, that's kind of weird. Uh, that's fair, I need to play Fall Guys or something soon. Yeah, um, yeah, I'm trying not to burn myself out on Fall Guys, Ralic, because uh, as you know... CEO of Genera Staffing Services. We employ a large force of <laughs> driven, dedicated fortune workers ready to address oh, your fortune. Um, so, uh, like, Fall, Gu Fall Guys was great fun, but after 36 streams of it, plus other streams playing with friends, you know, it's, um, I don't want to be playing it, like, two, three times a week like I used to, you know? But, uh, hopefully, hopefully soon we'll be able to get something. Done. Right, let's see. So, oh, he looks dead. No oh, shit. Where the fuck are we? So these doors don't take us anywhere except the corpses. Uh, these are Vorcha. We've not really seen. So the, um, this game makes the introduction of the Vorcha. Uh, so they're kind of, uh, you know, they're kind of mean-looking motherfuckers. 
Oh, I can't seem to get over there. <laughs> I love that walk stance. That is a very rootin' tootin' I'm going shootin'! <laughs> oh, fantastic. And then Captain Boring is just being here being boring. What the fuck? Mm, delicious. Alright, let's, uh, let's leave. Oh, here we go. This is a, this, this is a better view of the porch. Yeah, here you go. There you go. Look at that. Look. <laughs> it's a fucking face of their mother could love. Jesus fucking Christ. Uh, so, Vorcha are a very, uh, you know, angry and... Uh, they're, they're not exactly militaristic. They're just... They're just like a violent group of people, to be honest. Uh, so, like... Uh, Vorcha, uh, Vorcha are hardy and they get stronger every time something like breaks and resets. So basically Vorcha parents just fucking beat cunt out of their kids just to, uh, just to, you know, make them all big and strong. So welcome to the slums. This is the side of Omega that's not the fucking nightclub. Where are we? Okay, so we're near the marketplace. Okay, people don't care. Or you don't want to. Does it really matter? No. Omega has worked this way for a very long time. No one's changing it now. Alright, bitch face seems like she's home. Hey, Shisk. I don't know a Captain Gavorn. Why would I tell him anything? We not trust you. Tell Gavorn we know his tricks. We not kill anyone today. Fair enough. I'll just be going. Go away. Talk too much. Gavorn's not talking to you. No more talk. Wait out, Gavorn. <laughs> Oh, hey, quarry in front? Right, where does... Does this take us upstairs? Yeah, it does, okay. Alright, let's talk to the quarry in. Hey, how you doing? Why is he... Why, why is he just... Might interest you in some salvage tech? You might. My credit goes toward a ticket to get me out of this forsaken rock. Oh, That sounds like a good cause. How's that Not going? Not very well. No one will buy anything at the prices Herrick forces me to ask for them. Oh. I buy a lot of parts and equipment. Maybe we well, can make... you seem like a decent person. Of course. Then we have a deal. Maybe I'll at least sell something to you. Yeah. What brought a nice kid My like pilgrimage. You? What money I had got stolen. Oh. So I decided to sell salvage parts. You can see how that turned out. Harrod's forcing me to sell high, and I can't even afford a ticket off this station. Yeah. I could pay your way, to be honest. How much do you need to get off Omega? I still need 1,000 credits to pay my way, but I couldn't let you do that. This is my mistake on my pilgrimage. It's my problem. Uh, fuck you, take the money. Here you go. 1,000 credits. Get out of here. I... Thank you. With this, I can finally continue on my pilgrimage. I'm going to buy my ticket right now. Thank you again. And I can still buy stuff from his shop. Yeah, boy. The couplings. So basically, the reason why I did that is because I imported my save from the last game with a metric fuck ton of. I, I maxed out my character. I had uh, over what ten million, a hundred million uh, credits. Uh, so I've got a lot of money, a lot of everything. Uh, so yeah, we've got a lot of money. So the couplings we will get. We absolutely will. Uh, heavy skin weave credits required seventy five thousand. That's quite a lot. Mm, don't really use these. Okay, cybernetic upgrade of heavy skin weave is probably going to be useful, to be honest. I want everything that gives me health. Okay, it's so it's re it's really expensive to purchase for the first, uh, you know, for the, for the early parts of the game as this is. There's just a lot of dead people here, what the fuck? 
Uh, right, what are we looking for here? Food, glorious food. I think the one thing I quite like about uh, Mass Effect 2. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Uh, one thing I quite like about um, yeah, Mass Effect 2 is um, I think uh, what's the, what's the right way of putting this? I think um, I think Mass Effect One had a bad habit of like. You know, it was a really pretty environment, the Citadel, but it didn't really feel like a place where people lived. Part of that's just because it was old, and part of that was just because, um, you know, it didn't, um, it didn't have a lot of things like 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 here. Like, and and this is one of the things I quite liked about um, Cyberpunk. So Cyberpunk is it. Oh, like, what the fuck? What the fuck? So, so, um, oh. What the hell? Uh, so Cyberpunk was a place that, um, it, it, Cyberpunk was a game where, you know, it, it's supposed to be set in a horrific world, you know, you're not supposed to feel happy about what you see. But the thing is, like, it actually feels like people, you know, live there, that, like, you know, people live and struggle there. And that's what I like that uh, uh, Mass Effect 2 introduces. So like you know we're in the fucking slums of the place, but here you go, you got a fucking you know restaurant cooking up. Oh no, it's pie jacks! They're cooking up pie jacks! Oh no, pie jacks are space monkeys and they're really cute and they're fucking cooking the eggs in them. But like it's just little details like that that just makes it feels like people actually you know live here. Hey Marsh. I might have something here for you, not much. Right. I'm in the mood to spend some money, but I think I can find better stuff elsewhere. Wow. You won't find a better selection anywhere, unless you're willing to risk black market. Yes, please. I'd rather deal with you than give money to those thieves. You sure we can't make a deal? Can I just parrot? I can't compete. I'll do what I can. But don't tell anyone. Wrong. Can I literally just gain paragon points just by fucking? Uh, just paragoning my way into cheaper money. Uh, right, okay, so... Oh, I can get a model! Yes, buy all the models! Get a Tyrion Cruiser. Sniper rifle damage for 50,000. <laughs> Fornax titillating alien magazine. Oh my! Okay, I don't really care about the visual stuff. Sniper rifle damage, I think, is going to be helpful. But before we commit to buying to it, let's go see what's happening in Parrot's Emporium. See, the thing, the other thing about Mass Effect, like, <laughs> the thing about Mass Effect, you have no idea how much I, I love the Mass Effect dresses. I would absolutely fucking love uh, a dress like this, like, <sighs> yeah, I, I, I would love to dress like this. this is the greatest threat to intergalactic hey, Harry. Tentatively excited. Welcome here. Is this Elcor got a cigar? For you. What kinds of things do you sell here? Friendly. He does! Parts, all kinds. Mostly. <laughs> mostly <laughs> legit. With pride. My prices are the lowest anywhere. I have things to do. Courteously. Have a fine day. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, it's an Elcor the fucking cigar. Let's go. <laughs> oh, I don't think I ever remembered this before. <laughs> I fucking. <laughs> I fucking love it. Alright, let's have a look here. Uh, so we can get a visor. Increases headshot damage by quite a lot. That's nice and cheap, to be fair. I might go ahead and get this. Let's get Geth Kit. Um. Okay, Terminus R. Oh, that looks hardcore. Um, okay, I think I want the sniper rifle damage before we start getting into fights. So basically, the reason why I'm quite passionately spending most of my money is uh, is simply because um, you'll remember from the previous 
from the previous Mass Effect 2 this should come in handy. that the combat is really fucking hard. Um, yeah, I might go ahead and get this. Um, the combat is really fucking hard on Insanity difficulty. Uh, so we need to we need to not do that. Oh shit! Yeah, I accidentally fat fingered and beat on the wrong button. Whoop -a uh, sorry, I didn't realize I fat fingered something. I must have done something that's accidentally put us on the chat screen. It's kind of weird. Sorry about that. Uh, right. So let's let's just refresh this. Um, uh, Naked Raider, thank you so much for the lurk. Ha hope you're doing well. Uh, yeah. Hope you're doing well, my friend. I need to leave a lurk on a friend. On some friend folks' folk pages. So, yeah. Um, the key to, so, um, uh, Mass Effect 1 on Insanity Difficulty, with the exception of the final boss fight with Saren, was honestly quite trivial it was really fucking easy um yeah it, it was i mean there's just, there's just no way of sugarcoating it it was really fucking easy mass effect 2 on the other hand is incredibly challenging right where am i going your eyebrows are nice you're a hey, fuck you! And you, Chewie Fresh. Wow. Protheans cast off the lacerations. The Kroger, the Forger, and the... Okay, so this is a quarantine zone. And this is a private residence. Complaining is pointless, human. There's a plague. Nobody gets in or out. You can't keep me out. I live in there. Okay, so the plague isn't going away anytime soon, but if the mercenaries actually do have some kind, some flavor of success, uh, Archangel would uh, would pass away, so uh, logic does dictate that we go and uh, pay a visit to Archangel. Oh, sorry, I'm just running the middle of this. Uh, right, let's go and let's go and find this transport hub type thing. Hey, how are you doing? Captain Gavorn, head of the Vorcha Task Force. Got something to report? What the fuck's a Vorcha Task Force? There's an awful lot of Vorcha here. What are they planning? Vorcha? Plan? <laughs> They're a pestilence, it's nothing bankful. more. They... Oh, shit, sorry, sorry. If they started planning, we'd all be in big trouble, yeah. I'll just be going. Keep moving. Alright. Let's talk to Mara. Look at the pretty. Omega, what a piss hole. At least it keeps you on your toes. Wow, aren't you? I've come here on business before. I feel like I need a shower afterward, in addition to normal decontamination. Wow, on your delight. Uh, right, let's just let's put some depth of field off. Look at this view. Look at this. All right, let's uh, let's let's go fucking save Garrus. Oh shit! I spoiled it. I spoiled it. Fuck. Well, <laughs> I'm on the mission. I hope you're ready. Archangel's been annihilating you freelancers. Yeah, let's ready go. When you are. Get in. Uh, all right. Let uh, fuck. I don't care about Zaid. As much as I don't want Captain Bland and uh, Bitch Face, just fucking. Let's just fucking take him and go. Yeah, okay. I don't have really uh, any other options than these. Wait, what? Okay, I can't. I can't change the loader. Exit. Okay, right here. Right, fine. Let's go. It's about time they sent me someone who looks like they can actually fight. Yeah. Can I tell you what we're up against. Not really. The recruiter was a little vague. We wouldn't get many hires if everyone knew the truth. Archangel's holed up in a building at the end of the boulevard over there. He's got superior position, and the only way in is over a very exposed bridge. It's a killing ground. <laughs> but he's getting tired, making mistakes. We'll have him soon enough. 
guys have a plan? A small team is waiting to infiltrate his hideout, but we need to draw Archangel's fire so they can move in. And that's where we come in. Exactly. You'll be on a distraction team. Head straight over the bridge and keep Archangel busy so the infiltration team can sneak in behind him. Fair enough. Sounds like a suicide mission to me. Funny Pretty you should much. say that. But you look like you can handle it. <laughs> you can handle <laughs> suicide. <laughs> wow. Talk to Sergeant Katka. He'll tell you when to go in. Yeah, okay. So the bridge is the only way to his hideout? Exactly. Archangel collapsed all the underground passageways and sealed the doors to the lower levels. We've got teams digging, but it's taking too long. If they can get the gunship flying again, that'll help. But I'm hoping the infiltration team will finish the job and we can all go home. Joe! Gunship? Oh, shit, no. Uh, return. They were using a gunship to take out one guy? Yeah, and Archangel shut it down. He didn't destroy it, but he knew just where to hit it to disable it. <laughs> it wasn't even a fair fight. At least not for us. Wow. Where's the infiltration team now? On the far side of the bridge near his hideout, but they can't get any closer without being seen. Fair enough. How'd they get that close without being seen? More distractions. Tarek used a gunship to keep Archangel busy. We were able to sneak a few men into his hideout before he took it down, but they're stuck there. Indeed. We need to keep Archangel focused on the bridge so he doesn't find them and wipe them out. Okay. What do you know about Archangel? I'm the wrong guy to ask. I just do logistics. Terra and enough. the Merc bosses have been dealing with it for a while now. But don't be surprised if they're not thrilled about talking to a freelancer. Fair I'm enough. i to go find Sergeant Kafka. Good idea. Watch yourself on the boulevard. Archangel's killed dozens out there already. Well, we might have a way in, but getting out could be interesting. Yeah, I won't think Let's them. find him first. Then we'll figure out how to get back. Right, so welcome to this part of fucking Omega. Shepard, I've scanned the area, but I am unable to plot any other paths to Archangel. Mm -hmm. Guess we're going with the Mercs. The heavy mechs and gunship possess considerable firepower. Weakening them before leaving will improve your chances. Uh, agreed. So you can see Archangel in the distance. There he is, just trying to clap kids. Right, let's go see if we can't find any trouble. Uh, I believe this is so. Basically, what you're gonna, see, you're about to see something, okay? And this is where I have to point out that my my shepherd is mostly paragon, but is a bit of a grey shepherd. Uh, so I will, uh, I will do renegade options as and when it suits me, okay? As the first wave goes in, the infiltration team will attempt to take Archangel by surprise. Let's read this. Tarek, I've spoken to Garm. Uh, he and his men are on board. Assuming this operation is successful, we can count high morale uh, and extensive buy-in from the men. From the losses we've taken already, possibility exists that we won't have the men needed to continue on to the next objective. It's clear, though, that none of our organizations will be ready to move on area without the assistance of the other two. Interesting. Well, we'll pick up we that don't expect much from the freelancers. When they, the light mechs go in first. If that's not enough, we send in the heavy. Be prepared. Who are you, Jar? Need something? Who are you? You lead the Eclipse? You figure that out by yourself? I'm Jareth. I run Omega's Eclipse. What do you need, freelancer? Hmm. So the infiltration team is the main focus of the attack. Tarek's plan, not mine. He doesn't want to lose any more men, so he's throwing you freelancers at the problem. Archangel's not going anywhere, so I suppose there's no harm in trying. Who knows? Maybe you'll get lucky. Wow. What do you know about Archangel? His life expectancy is shortening quickly. Is that it? Nobody Love seems it. to know anything about him. Hey, hey Badger! How's it going? He's smart, he's resourceful, and he's dangerous. Mm. But we've got him cornered. He won't be making fools of us much longer. Why don't you say that? Can I assist you further? Why are Eclipse on Omega in the first place? Since you care so much, Eclipse controls almost 20% of Omega. Our transports and mechs keep the Ezo moving. Sounds well. very organized. Eclipse runs like a well-oiled machine, but Omega is anything but organized. It's a constant battle for control. Then Archangel comes along and complicates things even more. Archangel does complicate Archangel things. You so much trouble. Ask him. I'm just here to make as much money as I can. 
We didn't Fair come enough. to Omega to be constrained by laws and regulations. He'll regret ever coming to Omega, I promise you. Ah, oh, you do seem pretty triggered. Like this is personal for you. He raided one of my transports last month, killed two of my best operatives. One of them was my brother, so yes, it's pretty damn personal. Well, big side, goodbye. How's it going? Good idea. So this is, uh, yeah, I don't, I don't think we've actually really come across a, uh, a painted, uh, a painted Solarian before. There you go, he's got his, got his wee face paints on. Uh, right, fine, so that was the leader of the Eclipse. Who could arc it? Yeah, I've already spoiled it, but I've already accidentally spoiled it, Badger. Wait, what do you mean I can't use the map here? What the fuck? Oh, Lord! Ooh. He's a, oh, this is a mech room. Hello. Okay, let's hack this. Uh, target code selectman is uh, orange, green, orange, blue. Uh, orange, green, orange, blue. Wait, oh. Fuck. How does this even work? No. What? Oh. Dad. Find ma- uh, hang on, I should probably read this. Find the matching code segments, locate and select the code that- on the top left of the screen. Avoid red codes. Uh, right, okay, so, orange, green, orange, blue. Let's go. We're gonna start the hack. Uh, orange. There's one. How'd I select it? It won't let- okay, right, there we go. Uh, uh shit. Orange, green, orange, blue. Uh, and that one there. Huh? Oh, did I run out of time? Fuck! Okay, so I've got to pass through them. Oh shit, I probably should have. So it's got, it's the only one with fucking purple in it. Uh, purple? Purple. Oh, it changes every time. This is hard to watch. I can't remember how this mechanic works, okay? Fuck you. Uh, okay, so this one. It also doesn't help that I can't remember the control. Fuck up. Uh, green and then a metric ton of purple. So this one. Uh, and then we're looking for... This is just like basic pattern recognition, which I've not got. Yay! Okay, right. So it changes each time. That was my problem. Okay. Fine. Oh, easel. Fantastic. Um. Ooh. Bypass friend or foe ID. Yes, please. See, this one's nice and easy because it is just basic fucking... Basically, this this is ba this is shut up badger shut up this is more my intelligence level. That should slow them down. Okay, so the right. heavy mech. It'll be hostile if they activate it. Go. Cool. So heavy mech is uh, ab abused. So only. Hmm. Hmm. Right, let's go talk to. Uh, you can manage symbol matching then. Yes, I can, badger. So this is, uh, well, let's talk to Garm, shall we? Jesus Christ. You're in the wrong place, freelancer. Who the fuck are you? Blood pack leader? Name's Garm. That's all you need to know. Respectable. I'm stuck here waiting till you freelancers are done playing war. Go. Ask your questions and go. Uh, excellent. What do you, what know, do you know about, about Archangel? Archangel? He's a pain in the ass. He's a Turian. Which makes him slightly worse to look at than you. Wow, Garb. Until he realizes you're more than he bargained for. Sounds like you've had personal experience. He tried to take me down once. Waited till I was alone. Longest damn fight of my life. But I held him off till my men showed up. He wasn't so tough after that. We chased him over half of Omega. <laughs> Almost had him. But the slippery bastard snuck away before we could pin him down. Fair enough. What is the blood pack? Why are the blood pack on Omega? We're the muscle on this bloody station. You need protection or want someone removed? Talk to us. The, <laughs> the Vorcher are just so uncomfortable to look at. Like <laughs> everybody loves us and everybody hates us. Yeah, fair enough. 
All right, what's your plan? Under the blood pack attack. Damn, Tarek wants us to wait. I hate waiting. But he says the Suns have a plan, and they don't want us getting in their way. Huh? We're supposed to wait until the Eclipse and their max. We'll see. Fair enough. Have a nice day. I should get going. About time. Wow. Wow. Vorture Field Hospital. Who'd have thunk it? Ah, cheers, Bob. Alright, let's try and cross the bill. Oh, well, sad. He did. Alright, anything hot and spicy here? Oh, good. Let's let's do this again now that we know how it fucking works. Uh, right, okay, so we're looking for white. Uh, so we're looking for you. The next one. Uh, here. Oh, come on, you're gonna have to give us it. You can't fail us if you don't give us what we need. There we go, there it is. Woo! I get hollow dollar bill. Six thousand hollow dollar bill. Right, let's, let's cross to the side so we don't get absolutely fucked by... Hmm, this looks, this looks problematic in nature. Uh, oh, I can, I can unlock this door. Cool. Uh, you, 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 this one's really fucking easy. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's open you and see what we get. Ooh, med supplies. Actually, do you know what? Med supplies are really fucking huge, because uh, I had to use them all in the last fight I had to do. This is valuable. Oh yeah, submachine gun damage. Let's go. Power set. Oh, yes. Look at this. Fucking small fortune we've just made for ourselves. So I assume this is where we're supposed to go. Hey, freelancer. How you doing? I'm looking for Sergeant Kafka. You and me both, lady. He's over there working on the gunship. I'll go over the bridge when he gives the word. Go talk to him if you want, but I'm in no hurry. Right. I'll be right back. Good luck. Watch out. Oh, damn, son! Right, Archangel. Don't fucking... Don't shoot me. Okay, so this is... This is a gunship. And this does appear to be the sergeant. So let's, uh, let's go chat to... Kafka? Let's go and chat to him. So this was my first ever renegade choice in Mass Effect. How are you doing? Uh, you must be the group Salky mentioned. You're just in time. Salky? You met him when you were dropped off. He radioed to say you were coming. You three kind of stand out from most of the other freelancers. Well, the server is uniforms and the, the N7 uniforms. Yeah, fair enough. The signal. Archangel won't know what hit him. Right. Got any questions? This may be your last chance. Uh. Yeah. Will this gunship be working? That mechanic looks like he's working too hard. It's not a mechanic. Are you gonna give us cover with the gunship? Huh. Tarek is the only one who flies her. Oh, I can kill Tarek. She's not quite ready. That bastard Archangel gave her a beating last time she was out there. A few more tweaks, she'll be as good as new. Why are you coordinating the attack and fixing gunships? I'm in the infiltration group. Our team coordinates with the gunship. I'm staying back to organize the freelancers and make sure the gunship's ready to go if we need her. Fair. How will the infiltration team get to Archangel? They've got two options. They trap them in close quarters and finish the bastard off face to face. If that doesn't work, they have explosives. They'll just need time to set up. Fair enough. Uh, what about the bridge? So the bridge is the only way in. Until the gunship's working again, or the blaster's finished with the tunnels. Look, we got a plan. We don't need you trying to come up with any great ideas. Oh wow, Just Sergeant! Do your damn job. Collect your credits and go home. All this for five hundred credits. Uh, yeah, I've already stolen like what, fucking eight thousand from these guys behind the scenes. Like, yeah, 
Uh, the mechanic is working too hard. I wonder if we can maybe uh, to jump stop them. Head for Archangel's right. building. Try not to get killed too fast. You're only a distraction as long as you're alive. Respectable. You don't have to make it all the way across. Just keep Archangel watching that bridge. The infiltration team will do the rest. <sighs> Fair enough. Are you leading the assault? Ha! <laughs> Tarek doesn't pay me to fight. I just plan the attacks and fix the damn gunship. You freelancers get the privilege of... Target is in sight. Where a go? Check. Bravo team. Go, go, go. Fucking A-team. Archangel's got quite a surprise waiting for him. Yes, he does. No more waiting for me. He's gotta, gotta go back, back to, to the gun. Yeah. Before Tarek decides he needs her again. Whee! Would be a shame if somebody were to uh, feed him to the gunship. You're working too hard. <laughs> he was working too hard. Sad. Unfortunate. Doesn't look like Archangel's got much time. Nope. Well, let's not wait around too long. Quite. <laughs> These guys a surprise oh shit, there's one room there's, there's one room I didn't check. Why have I got my grenade oh shit, why have I got my grenade launcher? Not a grenade launcher. Let's get a sniper rifle. Alright, let's get to him. Can we defuse the bomb? I wonder, do we just like... Not good. Oh, what am I stuck on? What the fuck? Hang on, okay. <laughs> that didn't go well. Uh, that didn't go well at all, in fact. I, 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 I felt almost tempted not to include that on death counter. I felt tempted not to include that on the death counter purely because um, I didn't want to... I, I, that, that was a bit bullshit. I just stopped moving when I wasn't actually stuck on anything. Um, but I did die. And I have been counting stupid deaths before. So there we go. We've now officially hit the half century, folks. Okay, so there's Archangel. Let's, uh... Okay, so we're over the bridge. Uh, that is the total including Mass Effect 1, yeah. Okay, so I think there's nothing behind us, and we're in a relatively defensible position here. So let's, uh, let's just go ahead. Do we have the... Do we have the option of... Okay, let's put our ammo on here. So this will help get through his shields, which we'll do with a bop. Okay, now we're in a much more defensible position. So let's just gently expose ourselves. Good shot. Oh shit, that was Right, can we disarm this bomb? No. I didn't finish sending, oh my god, is there just fucking corpses in here? Uh, what can I see to act? I can see something to activate here. Medkit, yeah. Let's just do this. Uh, right, let's quickly steal I'll take this. It. Take damage, you boy! Right, let's, let's go talk to Archangel. So we've disabled that bomb. You're That's up. huge. However, we can see something that we're not happy with. <laughs> do you guys want a bippity? Yeah. Grabbing cover. Heading to cover. Yes. Have a nice trip. Quite. Ah, <laughs> uh, that was funny. Oh, it was a wall safe. Let's uh, let's just loot Archangel. Uh, okay, I don't think we. Can, I don't. I, I don't want to take too much stuff here, but Archangel's not under danger at least, which is pretty pretty Uh Let's open the door. 
Hey, how you doing? Archangel. Yeah, so to be fair, I think we died like nine times in the final battle of, uh, of Mass Effect 1, so yeah. So far, 10% of everything Shepard. is Mass Effect 1. Hey, Garrus! How you doing? I thought you were dead. Garrus! What are you doing here? Garrus! Keeping my skill sharp. A little target practice. Oh, are you sleepy? You okay? Been better, but it sure is good to see a friendly face. Killing mercs is hard work, especially on my own. What are you doing out here on Omega? I got fed up with all the bureaucratic crap on the Citadel. Figured I could do more good on my own. At least it's not hard to find criminals here. All I have to do is point my gun and shoot. Hmm. Renegade Garrus, Jesus. How'd you manage to piss off every major Merc organization in the Terminus systems? It wasn't easy. <laughs> I really had to work at it. <laughs> I'm amazed that they teamed up to fight me. They must really. Uh, Since when did you start calling yourself Archangel? It's just a name the locals gave me for all my good deeds. <laughs> I don't mind it, but please, it's uh, <clears throat> just Garrus to you. You didn't shoot me. You nailed me good a couple times, by the way. He didn't. Because of rounds only, no harm done. Didn't want the Mercs getting suspicious. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. If I wanted to do more than take your shields down, I'd have done it. Besides, you were taking your sweet time. I needed to get you moving. Hmm. Uh, I like how uh, I like how Garrus has evolved from nervous constable in Mass Effect One to just Daddy Garrus. Jesus Christ. Well, we got here, but I don't think getting out will be as easy. No, it won't. That bridge has saved my life, funneling all those witless idiots into scope. But it works both ways. They'll slaughter us if we try to get out that way. So we just sit here and wait for them to take us out? That's it's exactly not all what we that. did. This place has held them off so far. And the three of you, I suggest we hold this location, wait for a crack in their defenses, take our chances. It's not a perfect plan, but it's a plan. <sighs> yeah, fair enough. How'd you let yourself get into this position? My feelings got in the way of my better judgment. It's a long story. I'll make you a deal. You get me out of here alive. And I'll tell you the whole damn thing. Arrangeable. Have a nice day. If we fight as a team, we'll hold them off. You're right. Their numbers won't help them in here anyway. Let's see what they're up to. So there was a dude with the bomb who we at least got rid of. Hmm. Looks like they know their infiltration team failed. Take a look. Scouts. Eclipse, I think. That looks like a lot more than scouts. Mm. Indeed. We better get ready. I'll stay up here. I can do a lot of damage from this vantage point. You, you can do what you do best. Just like old times, Shepard. Daddy Garrus. Wow, really? I'm taking heavy fire. Is Miranda fucking dead, by the way? Ah, oh, fuck, I missed, I missed, I missed, I didn't, I didn't. Bum, fuck, bum, 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 bum. Oh, what? Wait, bow. Vindicator battle rifle. Fuck yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we do have light max. Are any of them? Any of them still outside? Oh, oh. that's good. Eclipse marks rear stairs. System not designed for specialized ammunition. Yeah, your mother's not designed for specialist ammunition. Woohoo! 
fucking got ya. Alright, let's go. Oh, damn. Garrus, you're not a very sound tactical fighter. Okay, we need these fucking things dealt with. Well, he's dead. I love this right. Oh. Well, thankfully we're both good at snipers. Well. Oh well, he's not dead. No, he's dead. Have a nice trip. Target down. Well, that was dark. Uh, pop, pop goes the gentleman. Oh. Scope down, drop. I really am not doing. Ah, fuck! I missed that shot. I needed to not miss that shot. Let's make sure this is clear. Whoa, whoa! What the fuck? Uh, fuck knuckles. Going now. Move it. I can smell you. Oh, fuck, he's right there. Grabbing cover. Got him. Yeah, Gareth, you're not actually the most tactically sound individual, it has to be said. Well, there is, there is contact. There is, he's right there. Oh my god, that's a fucking rocket launcher! What the fuck?! <laughs> like that one, just like, whee! <laughs> You want a bippity boppity? Oh fuck! Oh damn! She just got shot right through the boot. All right, let's see how you handle this, Archangel. Oh lord, it's coming! Go. Hey, how you doing? Yes, they are the set of sending out the heavy max. That problem should take care of itself. Would be a shame if something had happened to that heavy mech. Heading to cover. Oh wait. Good shot. Come on. Missing these basic shots. Oh, fuck. In fact, there's four. It's about four rounds I've not hit a fucking single sniper shot. Eclipse marks have made it into the base. Well then. Oh fucking hell! I just shot this. I just shot his childhood memories clean out of that man's head. Fuck. Run away, coward. I need some ammo. Ammo's what I need. 
Ah, uh, fuck. Yeah, I use that too. Okay. Oh, that's right. Wait, are you dead? It's gonna blow! <laughs> ah, he just kicked the fuck out of that man. Is that Jared? That might be Jared. Yeah, that's Jared. Focus fire on that Kunt Waffle. Right. Friendly fire! Nope, it's an engineer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, there's Jared. About that. Whoa, that's a rocket! Die! Where'd she go? I need targeting assistance. Jareth, you're pissing me off. Moving to point. <clears throat> See if you guys start wandering in front of my bullets again, I'm gonna fucking pop a cap in your life. Jesus Christ. Oh! I just fucking... Uh, how do I use first aid? No squad members are down. That doesn't look accurate. Looks like that's all of them. Come find me before they regroup. Well... Well, well. <laughs> hey, Gareth, how you doing? You're kicking ass, Shepard. They barely touched me. Yay! We got Jareth in the process. That we did. Hunting that little bastard for months. Why were you after him? He's been shipping tainted Izo all over Citadel space. Half the goods I seized back at CSEC came from his team here on Omega. I took out a big shipment a while back and killed this top lieutenant in the process. Not surprised he decided to work with the other mercs after that. <laughs> We've still got blood pack and blue suns left. Think we can make a break for it? Maybe. Let's see what they're up to. Let's uh while they're doing that, let me go get some Reinforce the other side heavily, but they're not coming over the bridge yet. The engineers have made it through the lower level. Whoa. Well, they had to use their brains eventually. <laughs> you better get down there, Shepard. I'll keep the bridge clear. Um. Let's split up two and two. Keep one of my team here. You sure? Who knows what you'll find down there? Um. Yeah, Miranda, you stay. Miranda, stay with Garrus. Keep him alive. Thanks, Shepard. You better get going. How do I get to the basement? Go down a level. The basement door is on the west side of the main room behind the stairs. I'll radio directions if you <sighs> Alright, okay, okay. Quick. Good All right, go. we're going. We're fucking going, let's go. No, oh, 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 oh. Alright. So we got we got Miranda keeping Garrus alive. This is probably not a tactical sound give a, a tactically sound decision. Given that this is uh, you know, the hardest difficulty this game has to offer, and it is actually challenging, so. Move it. I like to move it, move it. Alright, where the fuck dungles are they? Get to the console and close that shutter before they can get through. What shutter? See you, shutter! Again. Ah, for fuck. Yes, I know we've got no shields. How the fuck am I supposed to get to this? 
If I ran past the panel. Oh, well. Apparent, apparent. <laughs> Your eyebrows are a large shutter, come on. Okay, there we go. Whoop! Ah, I got fucking- Oh no, I got cooked! Hey bro, how's it going? Oh, I got fucking cooked to death, Jesus Christ. And that makes it 51 deaths. Sounds like a challenge. Come on, shields, recharge. Preferably not Vorture. Yes, I'm, I'm. I am trying to get on it, Garrus. That isn't. This isn't quite as easy as, as you might fucking think. In it. Get over, get over, get over, get over, get over, get over, get over! Fucking hell, game! So, do you remember how I said that the mechanics in two were better than one? Do you know what? I think, uh, I think. Oh, fuck. I think I might have been lying, actually, because if I can't quickly vault over something to get to safety, that's gonna be what they call in the trade L Big Problematical. <laughs> Fuck, I missed. Is anyone else coming over? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. To be fair, I think I actually have to fight forward with this. I think the I think this is infinitely spawning. Okay, let's break out cover. Let's go over. Whoa. I've got no ammo. Bo -bo 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 let's see. Can I actually go under under a berry? Okay, okay, fine. Apparently the pyro can just fucking see me. Cool. Alright. Well, that's fucking good to know, isn't it? Fuck me. Oh, shit. That shouldn't have missed. That puts us in the back foot a little bit. Targeting. Really? Am I just keeping missing here? Like, this is just not helpful. Right. Ah! This is so fucking frustrating! So frustrating! I wonder if I wonder if I wonder if I'm I wonder if I'm not doing this as intelligently as I should be. I wonder if I should be using Okay. Moving you. to cover. Yeah, just fucking let's go. Right, let's change tack here. <laughs> Fuck! Okay, that is the way to do it, but I overexposed myself. 
Yeah, they don't call it insanity for nothing, ain't that the truth? Okay, so I need to use a grenade launcher. The grenade launcher is a serviceable idea for this. Jacket. Yeah. Pick me again, bro. I fucking dare ya. Right, you, get over there. Sure thing. Go on, Jacob. On Alright, I don't want to exhaust all the ammo here. Let's just wait until he stands up. Really? Oh wait, I'm still alive? What the fuck? Where the fuck is this pyro? There's a console near the shutters. The problem is being a Vorcha. Being a Vorcha, he can he can heal himself. <laughs> being a Vorcha, he can heal himself faster than I can kill him. <sighs> okay, we've got the tactic though. We've got the tactic that we need. We now just need to implement it successfully. So shield up. Oh. Got it. Could you guys stop coming around this fucking car? Oh god, my sniper rifle. Right, let's go. Get over, get over, get over. Oh! Why can't he stand up so fucking fast? Stop standing up so fast! Oh lord, uh, I do apologize if the stream is not looking too good. I just seen that there is an issue with stream upload quality. For some reason it's telling me that uh, the stream isn't uh, behaving right. Alright, Captain Bland, I require your assistance. Good work. Good work. Oh, fucking outstanding. Now I just need to be very careful to not die. Let's get a sniper rifle back. Here they come. There's not too many yet. Okay, there's the shutters. Let's go. There's a console near the shutters. I can see it. Commencing shutdown. Just one more shutter. Hurry. Okay, let's fucking save that. Oh, I remember this bit being a pain on normal difficulties. Yeah, I think the problem is, is because Vorcha can heal themselves, uh, if I use any non-explosive gun, they can heal themselves faster than I can actually do damage to them. Uh, fuck, I didn't need that. I need to keep that. Um, so, yeah. So my difficulty here. Oh shit. Moving to point. Right. 
Mm. Fuck, I missed. Now I have no ammo. I have no ammo. <laughs> well, that didn't go well. That didn't go well at all. So basically, every fight scene now is just going to be adding like a whole ton of deaths. Like, I need to be careful with my bullets here. This is not cover. Huh? Oh. Oh. Fuck. So my difficult, my key difficult. Oh, Jacob dead? No, Jacob. So part of, yeah, part of the problem is that I have no clips here. I wonder, right, before we take this fight, let's have a let's have a better scan around for some fucking animal. So there's a with the bridge. You close those shutters, we can't fight them in two places at once. Yeah. Fuck! Just one more shutter. Hurry. Come on, I'm trying I'm making another push. I'm taking some fire, but I'm okay so far. Could you fucking not? I'm trying to rush it. I'm trying to do things too quickly, and it is problematic. Clap one. What the fuck? How did that miss? Alright, I need I need, I need I need you back. Good work. Okay, give me my pistol back. Moving to point. Oh, I've got no shields at all. Come on over. Yeah. All right, good work, Jacob. What gun are you using? I don't really like the idea of using a shotgun. Okay, move up. 
Let's do this tactically, come on. Oh fuck, he's here! Well, he's dead. That was a thing. Right, very quickly, let's... Okay, can I heal you? What is my button? It's Unity. Alright, I can with this. Oh, come on, don't die, not like this. We need to back off a sec. Monty, with the bridge. You close those shutters. We can't fight them in two places at once. Okay, we've used Unity. That's gonna get Jacob up. What do you mean one more shutter? We fucking shut it. Dead again? Ah! What the fuck? Uh, how was your night of st streaming? Uh, yeah, it was good. So I don't know what happened there. We fucking shot that shutter. Like. And let yourself be shot to death, you stupid, stupid man. I am starting to regret not having Miranda along with us for this one. This is this is where I start. This is where I start taking exception to uh, the way that games. The oh, fuck. Yeah. So when when I am starting to die. When I'm starting to die because the game is sucking me into cover when I don't want it to. Like, I don't mind dying because I've done dumb things, but when the game is legitimately fucking me over, right. I, I, don't, I don't care for that at all. Well, that's <laughs> over already. I wonder if we're maybe trying the wrong side. Let's try this side. I mean, to be fair, this one's not really going to work so well because... Yeah, that, that one was that one was never going to work because I took too much health damage when, when we started. Okay. Right. We can do this. We can do this. We've almost done it until the game fucked us over. Moving to cover! No shield! Yeah, good point, there is no shield. I'm making another push, I'm taking some fire, but I'm okay so far. Damn it, Shepard! <clears throat> okay, you're kind of in the open, you absolute fucking jackass cockwomble.
I've died more times in this one section than I have in the entire fight with Saren in Mass Effect 1 in the higher hard difficulty. <laughs> If we just take this fight all on the side. Hang on a minute, hang on a minute. That might fucking do us. Okay, that's that's fucking delightful, Garrus. No game. Wow, now there's a Varen here. How much fucking fun is that? Ah, for fuck's sake, what are you doing here? Whoa, 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 whoa. See, the problem, my problem isn't that it's hard. It, it's a, My problem is that the game keeps fucking me over. Like, the way that it just fucking cancelled the door closing for no obvious reason. Uh, I want to see, to be honest. I want to see if I can disable getting into cover. Except by when I push a fucking button. I guess I can of am though. Got it. making another push. I'm taking some fire, but I'm okay so far. Wow, Garrus, that's just fucking delightful. They are through your shield, Shepard. You've got no fucking shields. What did you fucking expect? <sighs> yeah, this is uh, this is hard. This is uh, currently monumentally hard. So just a just a reminder that I've never actually done this game at this difficulty before. Um, I did try it very briefly once when I first started. I 
Jacob, you need to you need to push up a bit here. Sheepy boy boy. Do you wanna fucking shoot something at any fucking point, you prick? Okay, this this Baron is gonna go be a distraction. Kill them! Kill the Varen, I won't have to kill you. Right, let's use Okay, we need we need to get this fucking waffle up. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, I am. I am kind of ready to die. To be perfectly honest with you. Where'd you go? Yeah, where did I go, Mr. Krogan? Okay. Okay, the Krogan's dead. Jacob, the Jacob's also dead. Problematic. Okay, Unity. Let's get him up. Oh, come on, gun! Sure thing. Right, okay, 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 we can do it. Okay, there's a fucking Vorch over here. Should be a baron coming. There is two, one. Oh my days! It's over. They're coming in through the door. <laughs> it's fucking over. Uh, ripped them to shreds. Hey hey. Watch my back. I'll deal with Archangel. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, so the fucking thing about this, right? Oh, fuck. Varen, 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 Varen. Fuck you, you Varen piece of shit. Right. Right, let's get upstairs to Garrus. Okay, it would be helpful if we could fucking hit anything. Right, you guys need to get up here right now. I swear to God, if you guys aren't there right now, I'm gonna fucking shoot you both myself. Where did I go? Shield fail. Now let's finish you off. Yeah, it's quiet. Let's let's finish him off. Oh yes, got the finishing shot on him. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, how are we doing? So that was... So here, here's the thing, right? Here's the thing. So, 
I, I, I spent most of that getting absolutely fucked over by the mechanics of Jacob not going where I was telling him to because he was taking the fucking most arduous path through as many enemies as possible dying. Uh, I was getting slurped into things when, um, when I shouldn't have been. Uh, and also my gun wasn't reloading when it should have. So yeah, I feel like I had, a, I, I feel like I had got the unfair end of the stick there, but uh, yeah. These guys are dead, I suppose. Hmm. Tough bastards, but I've seen worse. Right. And we took out Garm and his blood pack. This day just gets better and better. He was one tough son of a bitch. You fought with him before? Yep. Yeah, we tangled once. Caught him alone. None of his hey, came to help him. We still couldn't take him out. I've never seen a Krogan regen that fast. He's a freak of nature. He just kept at it until his Vorcha showed up. It was close, but I had to let him go. That. Not this time. All right. Only the blue suns are left. I say we take our chances and fight our way out. I think you're right. Tarek's got the toughest group, but nothing we haven't faced before. Besides, he won't be expecting us to meet him head on. Look out! Damn it, I thought I took that thing out already. Mm. They fixed it, but not completely. They're all loading troops. Jentha? Who the fuck is Jentha? <laughs> Oh, I wonder if she was one of the ones in the room that we didn't actually go visit. Yeah, we have lost shields, haven't we? This is somewhat problematic. Right, can we fucking deal with this? Absolute bint of a woman! Come on! Pop this woman in. Oh wait, Jacob's dead. Woohoo! Why the fuck is Why the fuck is Jacob dead? Why the fuck is Who the fuck is Jenta? Why the fuck is she still alive? Fucking. One less to worry about. Yeah, tell me about it. The repelling down the side wall. Right, Jacob, on your fucking feet. Which side wall? Which side wall do you re fucking fare? They've reached the rear stairs. Your mother's a rear stair. Fuck you. Yeah, well, if Garrus could stop making life ch poor life choices, this would be a whole fucking lot easier to deal with. Please don't rocket launcher, Garrus. Okay, can you guys stop fucking rocket launchering my shit? Okay, they can't get to us too easily from here. Woo! Fuck you, Garrus! Uh, oh, thank you. Thank you for the hydrate, CQ. I, um... I'm not sure what's happening here. But my internet appears to have failed. The stream up rate and down rate is just being problematic just now. And I'm not sure why. Uh, well, this isn't. A, I've added a death, but this isn't really a death, to be honest. This is more of an objective failure. Um. Yeah. Okay. So. Something's happening to my internet here. I'm not quite sure what. If it keeps dropping out, we might have to consider what we're going to do with the stream. But, um, yeah, so far it's not that common. 
Hey, Yaka Bear, how's it going? Yeah, I'm not too bad. Oh, fuck, we're all the way completely. back here. Make sure of that. Right. Watch your back. Oh, I'll watch my back. Don't you wear your little cotton fucking socks, my sunshine. Sunshine, lollipops, and rainbows. Come here, flesh. Now let's finish you off. <laughs> oh my, Miranda. Oh my, indeed. You and your tomfoolery, folks. Oh, I've got him. Okay, I just shot the childhood memories out of that man. That is acceptable. Oh, ho, 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 ho. Ah, you fucking hooker. Yeah, we'll just double team him. That's what we'll do, Garris. Oh, Lord, it's another heavy. Do not want a heavy. Oh, Miranda's dead. Wakey wakey Miranda. Oh Jacob's dead. Good, perfect. I could use some help. I know you could use some help. Garrus, don't die. I need I need to be occupado for a second. I think there's another health container around here. Oh lord, where the where the Fuck nuggets did you come from, you absolute waffle. Going to ground. Okay, okay. Are we good? Are we good? Uh, this has been a couple of little stream freezes, but it's fine otherwise. Yeah, my internet keeps dropping out. I'm not too happy with it. I threw a man into the jet engine. How did he not die? What the fuck? But yeah, Angel, I'm doing okay. I hope you are doing well. Woo! That's an explosion. Damn, son, he did. Sure thing. Okay, so he's on like half fucking health here. Grab shit! I see you, Tarek! Shaking that ass! Is he going over? Oh, fuck, Knuckles! So, the good news is we don't have to worry about keeping Garrus alive on account of the fact that he's dead. Right, you forgot your childhood, let's make you forget the rest of your fucking life. Right, can you cunts, can you cunts just fucking fuck up that shit so I can stop being annoyed for two seconds. Yeah, not a problem, where the fuck are you guys? Why are you fucking pricks outside? I'll get your mother a fucking visual. Fuck you. Fuck your happiness. Fuck your life. Fuck off. And die. Where is he? I have no idea where the fuck this guy is. Oh, he's coming here? Yeah, he is, he is, he do be. Woohoo! 
Right, I'll shoot the childhood memories out of you and we're done. Thank fuck for that. Ah, oh, Garrus is dead, unfortunate. Daddy Garrus, are you okay? Clutch <laughs> gun. We're getting you out of here, Garrus. Just hold on. <laughs> Not the calibrations. Yeah, Mr. Radio calibrations Joker. is dead. Make sure they're ready for us. We better hurry. He looks bad. He does look bad. That is big sad energy right there. All around me is big sad energy. Woohoo! We've leveled up. We've extracted Arch. Uh, we have uh, extracted Archangel from the mercenary siege and recruited him for the team. Unclear whether the injury to Archangel will impair his ability to assist in the mission. Regardless, revelation of the identity is Garrus for Kieran, useful in keeping Shepard comfortable. Applied. Uh, we picked up a Vindicator battle rifle, uh, favored by assassins and yada yada yada. Deadly at any range and effective against armor. Oh, blah blah blah. blah that's right. Got shub a shub a shop a Sean Connery shub machine gun damage, tech damage credits and some keys. Oh, banging! Yes! Wow! Oh, Captain Bland, how can I assist you? Commander, we've done what we could for Garrus, but he took a bad hit. Mm. The docs corrected with surgical procedures and some cybernetics. Best we can tell, he'll have full functionality, but. Hey, Garrus. Shepard. <laughs> Tough son of a bitch. Didn't think he'd be up yet. Nobody would give me a mirror. How bad is it? <laughs> no worse than usual, buddy. I feel like that's something Ralik would say to Garrus. Hell, Garrus, you were always ugly. Slap some face paint on there and no one will even notice. <laughs> oh, oh, don't make me laugh. Damn it, my face is barely holding together as it is. <laughs> um, women find facial scars attractive. Those women are crooked. Uh, I like, I like, I, I like that he's just like. Frankly, I'm more worried about you, Cerberus Shepard. Do you remember those sick experiments they were doing? Yeah. That's why I'm glad you're here, Garrus. If I'm walking into hell, I want someone I trust at my side. You realize this plan has me walking into hell too. Just like old times. I'm fit for duty whenever you need me, Shepard. I'll settle in and see what I can do with the forward batteries. And, and thus Garrus begins his calibrations, as Roller likes to point out. Sorry, I jumped off to make miss dinner. Have, have I missed much? Yeah, you missed an entire story mission where we picked up Garrus and then he got uh, shot clean through the faceplate. I do like that he's not changed his armor and he's just in an aggressive amount of... Uh, Yeah, I like how we're parked on Omega, but somehow we're still warping through space. So if we go down and see, you know what I meant to say, do you? Commander, can I help you with something? We'll yep. talk later. Commander. Uh, right. So uh, no. Commander, can I help you with something? No. We'll talk later. Commander. The controls, the controls in two are so much more frustrating for me. I'm not that big a fan of it. Uh, right. Let's go to the crew quarters. And let's go pay a visit to Garrus, who's doing some calibration. Calibrations! Wow, wow! Skin a ba ba da Hey Garrus, how you doing? Shepard, need me for something? Yeah, well. Have you got a minute? Sure. Just checking the weapon systems. You can never be. <laughs> Look at him. He took. He took. He took an absolute fucking. In our fight oh. against Saren, mercenary work showed me otherwise. And now Cerberus rebuilds the Normandy with a few upgrades to boot. I wish we joined up with them sooner. Oh wow. Yeah, we're not with them. We haven't joined Cerberus. They're funding our mission. That's all. Relax, Shepard. Just a figure of speech. I can't exactly doubt your judgment. Not after I got my own squad killed. Oh no. What what happened? What did your Merc squad do? Didn't sound like you were available for hire. You saw Omega. It was full of thugs kicking the helpless. I formed my team to kick back. We weren't mercenaries. At least nobody was paying us. 
We made money by taking down slavers, pirates, or gangs that went too far. Mm, gangs what they hate you. It doesn't sound like you made any friends with the gangs. I got three separate Merc bands to work together to take me down. My man. <laughs> it was simple. We'd hit their shipments, disrupt activities, get under their skin, make them angry. They'd come charging right into our well-prepared kill zone, crossfire and snipers, clean and surgical. They never stood a chance. Well then. How'd you end up fighting mercenaries here on Omega? After the Normandy was destroyed, most of us went our separate ways. CSEC asked me back, but I turned them down. Fair. Omega was filled with criminals nobody else could touch. And there was no red tape to slow me down. It was a perfect fit. People here needed someone to believe in. Someone to stand up to the local thugs. Fair enough. That explains how you started. How'd you end up with a squad? Not too different from how you formed your squad to fight Saren, actually. You prove that you get things done, and people join up. Mercs who wanted to atone. Security consultants tired of playing by the rules. I gave them hope. He was Dead. the Archangel. Shows what I know. Tell me about your squad. There were 12 of us, including me. Former military operatives. CSEC agents. The usual. the usual. Had a Salarian explosives expert. Pretty sure he'd spent time in the special tasks group. My tech expert was a Batarian, believe it or not. Not the <laughs> friendliest guy, but he could hack any system ever built. Yeah, so squad. How did those mercenary gangs take down your team? It was my own damn fault. One of my people betrayed me. Oh, Garrus. A Turian named Sidonis. He drew me away just before the mercs attacked my squad. Then he disappeared. Everyone except me is dead because of him. And because I didn't see it coming. Mm. I'm not sure I understand. What happened exactly? Sidonis asked for my help on a job. When I got to the meeting point, nobody was there. By the time I got back to our hideout, the mercs had killed all but two of my squad. And they didn't last long. Oh, sad. Do you know where Sidonis is now? No. His trail vanishes after he leaves Omega, but I'll keep hunting. We'll get him, Garrus. My whole team, except for Sidonis. One day I'll find him and correct that. <laughs> correct that note. Yep. Thanks for coming by, Shepard. I've got some things to take care of. Oh, Big Garrus is sad. Shepard, need me for something? So what is the Normandy weapon? Can you tell me about the Normandy's armaments? Looks like Cerberus upgraded what the ship carried before. Should have a bit more kick. I do like Still a bit more kick. chances against a collector ship, though. Not unless we upgrade the guns. Mm, look out there. Have the Cerberus crewmen given you any trouble? I think being part of the team that took down Saren got me some points. Everyone I talked to was polite anyway. Fair enough, Garrus. We're all working together. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me. Good shit. Cool. So this is the ship's guns. These are some cryopods. I don't really know why we need cryopods when uh, the um, actual bedroom and things, but hey -oh. Um, Okay, so that is Garrus now arriving. Before I go do another, like, talk round about the entire crew, uh, let's go to the upper deck and let's try and get Morden back, because I would like Morden. Job security, those guns need attention, yeah. Uh, yeah. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Well, fuck. Paper more paperwork already. Um... Cerberus command request. Report tells us that you've been operating in the Omega Nebula. We'd look, like to leave you on Lorek, a nearby planet in the Fathar system. Scan the planet uh, for a base where we believe Eclipse Mercs are holding one of our operatives. You should be able to blah 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 blah. Delicate matter. Is this? So oh, it's from Cerberus command. Okay. Oh, hang on. This is the dude who we rescued. Hey, Aria, uh, Aria gave me this address. I think I met you in the afterlife on Omega. You stopped me from joining up with those mercs who were trying to take out uh, Archangel. Man, I was so pissed off at you. I got blind drunk that night, and it was a few days later before I got it together enough to check the news vid and saw that almost all those mercs had gotten killed. Uh, I don't know who you are or if you got there alive, but thanks. I felt really stupid when I heard about the body count, and I could have been part of it. I'll make the most of what you did for me. Aw, oh, bless his little cotton fucking socks. Right. 
Wait, hang on. Okay. So we now need to go to. We now need to go back to rescue. Uh, rescue Morden, who is in the quarantine zone. So we've got Zaid, which is fine. I don't really care much about Zaid, frankly. I um I did Zaid's uh, loyalty mission, but I literally don't think I ever uh, I ever actually did uh, did take Zaid on any missions. Right, Captain Bland's pissed me off by being absolutely defective when it. Oh, I can cycle his appearance. Ooh, shit. Let's go for some pretty armor. Why not? Right, let's add Garrus and let's add Miranda. Yeah, Garrus has pissed me off today. So I've got two things here. So this is quite helpful to get. So purchase rank. And I might purchase one of you ranks as well. Uh, Garrus, uh, auto level up. You've got nothing need doing. Okay. Let's go. So we're back here. Uh, oh yeah, shit, you can actually see it. Works for me. <laughs> Doesn't it just, Garrus? So here is, uh, well, here's party, uh, party Garrus. And his, uh, his new shiny armor. Mm. I don't like his, uh, I don't like his visor thing, to be honest, but hey -oh. Um, okay, right, let's go to the quarantine zone and let's go fuck up them shit. Galactic purity, you say? Uncomfortable. Cleaning is pointless, human. There's a plague. Nobody gets in or out. You can't keep me out. I live in there. I'm doing you a favor, lady. If you go in, the guards will cut you down. Okay. You can't do this. Everything I... I told you to get lost, lady. The plague has the whole zone quarantined. Nobody gets in. I'm human, you ass. Humans can't get the plague. Now let me get my stuff out before looters get it. This thing affects every other race out there. We're not taking chances. Nobody gets in until the plague has run its course. Wow, run its course. Yikes. There's a Solarian named Morden Solis in the slums. I've got to get in there to find him. The doctor? Yeah, a crazy bastard opened the clinic in the district a few months ago. The Blue Suns weren't too happy when he moved in. Uh, blue Suns suck a dick. trying to deal with the plague. I wish him luck, but the area is still locked down. Our orders are to wait until either the plague or the blue suns kill everyone, then go in and clean up. Okay, well, I can do those things. Listen, you're stuck here till this quarantine's over. That could take weeks. What you really need is to get this problem solved right now. That's what I do: solve problems. Let me in, and I'll. I like that nobody recognizes me. Right, recognizes me here. Like, yeah. why not? Quarantine is more to keep infected people in, anyway. I'll radio ahead. Tell them you're coming in. Wait, you're stopping me, but not them? You son of a bitch. You don't have a grenade launcher, lady. <laughs> <laughs> a quarantine zone for a plague that kills Turians. Why don't we ever go anywhere nice? Yeah, I don't want to stay back. It's safer to stick with a squad who's immune to the plague. It's your call, Shepard. If you need me, I'm not going to let a cough keep me back. We've only just picked you up. We're not, uh... Yeah, we're not gonna kill you. Or is he just coming? If we said we're not gonna take him and he's just gonna turn up anyway? Okay, no, it's gonna let me repick the thing. Fine. Fuck it, I guess. Oh, no, no, let's take Zaid. Let's take Zaid. Uh, Shepard will keep with the, uh... Well, can I? Is there any other things that I can take? No. Ah, uh, I need to buy weapons. What are my options for that? Oh, the arc projector. Um. 
Uh, all right, let's just uh, let's just see if we can't do that. Uh, Miranda, let's see. Is, okay, your choices are relatively well locked. Zaid, uh, Zaid, we do have an improvement for you. There you go, vindicator for you. Let's go. Bum, 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 bottom, bum. Welcome to the quarantine zone. We got fun and games. Uh, right. So we've got nothing for the grenade launcher. That's fine. So let's put some some ammo on this. Actually, hang on. What are the snow snowblind rounds? I I really have to check and see what we're going to be dealing with here. We can always change ammo types later. Right, do we have a map of the area? No, I don't. Okay, the objective's done this tunnel. Let's just go ahead and see. Oh, well. Found some easel, though. Bang it! It's laps. Caution! Quarantine in effect. Ah, I know that we knew. We all know that feel, don't we? We all know that, y'all. Big sad. Right. Uh, okay. Let's just keep going. Don't shoot. They're clear to come in. So these are the guards. All right. Ooh, shop. Hey, how you doing? Uh, right. Okay. Let's just advance. Lots of ammo clips. I feel like there's gonna be a fight here later. I feel uncomfortable here. Hmm. Well, I can hear coughing and there's Tyrians here, so uh, rip R.I.P. the Tyrians. Big sad. Good luck in there. Blue suns and Vorcha shooting anything that moves. Oh, good. Uh, well, that's a blue sun. Let's see if he shoot me. Yep. That is a hard fucking yes. Great control at its most basic. Pile the bodies in the street and burn them. Oh shit, is that oh god. I didn't even realize. I didn't realize, but uh yep, that is exactly what they're doing. They're just burning fuck out the dead during. Well, the dead. Oh wait, hang on, you're still alive. Hold on. Oh, bank terminal. Oh, fuck yeah. Uh, right, okay, so we're looking for orange, orange, purple, orange. So, orange, orange, purple, orange. Here we go. Uh, and then we're looking for orange, blue, white, orange. Uh, orange, White orange, and the last one we need is that one. Here we go. Let's get some money, honey. Woo. Uh, okay, where's our objective? Objective's this way. Let's speak to this Batarian then. Human. Should have guessed. Wow. <coughs> Bad enough you infect us with this blood. Wow. Now you lack the decency to even wait until I die before you come to steal my possessions. Yeah, you need help. Is there anything I can do for you? Get away from me, human. <laughs> Your kind has done too much already. Your plague did this to me. Your faint pity is the final insult. All right, fine. I need to find Morden Solace. Humans looking for the human sympathizer. <laughs> I hope the Vorcha burn Morden and his clinic to the ground. Well, fuck you too, cunt. I hope you... <laughs> I hope... <laughs> Damn it. Okay, stay with me. This won't cure the plague, but it might help a bit. Yeah, how's that feigned pity doing for you now, bitch? Uh, uh, oh, you, you help me. Why? It's what I do. 
I don't know if I can find a cure for this plague, but I'm gonna try. I'm not a I'm cunt. Sound sincere. <laughs> Maybe it's the fever. But as you said, what have I to lose? What do you wish to know? Uh why are you so convinced humans are behind this outbreak? The plague is too potent to be a naturally occurring virus. Airborne transmission across numerous species, near perfect mortality rate, it had to be created in a lab. And humans are immune. And since humans are the only species not affected, there is only one logical conclusion. Mm. I need to find Morden Solace. He has a clinic on the far side of the district. He's taking in refugees, offering to help those. Oh, Morden is bay. I was afraid to go to him before. He is dangerous. Perhaps he can help. How is he what dangerous? Makes worse than dying from the plague? The blue sons tried to press him for protection money. He killed them, <laughs> stunned them with some kind of toxin, then gunned them down. He's not just a doctor. Doctors don't execute people <laughs> and display the bodies as a warning. Ah, uh, like Martin. I fucking love Martin. About earlier. Before the quarantine, the blue sons controlled this district. But as their numbers fell to so the we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna get fight this more forge. The blue suns are fighting to protect their territory. But as the plague spreads, it's only a matter of time until the forge overwhelm them. Ah, uh, maybe, maybe, maybe. Um, I need to find more. Right, we're so just gonna. A, I was afraid to go to him before. When I find Morden, I'll tell him about you. If he has a cure, I'll make sure someone gets it to you. <laughs> Time is running short. I don't want to die. <coughs> oh, whatever. More. I should go. Goodbye, you. Yeah, he's happy with us, right? Let's uh, let's go loot this apartment and see what's here. Ooh, power cells. That's helpful. That'll give us some heavy ammo. Yes. Mm, sounds like there's people on the other side of this. Door control bypass. We donezo! Oh shit. Damn, he dead. Turn and play victim. Tried to claw his way out. Can't say I wouldn't do the same. Mm. Agreed, side. Computer console, play logs. Entry one. Enough. Entry tip. Nobody's even come by to check on us. Never thought the blue suns would turn their backs on me. This group used to stand for something. When I get out of here, I'm gonna make them pay. Yeah, I had that work out for you, Chief. Which means you have it too. Well, GG. GG for him. <laughs> Entry 4. So that's a wee bit of backstory on what happened with the plague, so somebody had to lock them in there. Uh, okay, right, I think we're gonna have to move to combat situation rather than uh, ra rather than responsive, so if we start seeing any Vorcha or Blue Sun, we're gonna have to shoot first. Let's see if we can break into this place. Start bypass. Wait, well, why don't it work? Door open! Let me see what we got. Oh, shit. Mm, this looks risky. Clear our corner. Oh, this isn't a corridor. 
Oh damn, this is somebody's room. Batarian? I ain't that. Watch it. Well, unfortunate. This isn't uh, much of a room, to be honest. It's literally just a bed, some storage, a desk, a toilet, and sink here. There's a bi big wide open space that I kind of don't really want to take. Objective is over that way. Right, let's do an upper sweep. Oh my god, there's a lot of blue sons over there. I like Zaid just fucking braving out in the fucking middle. Okay, no ammo on the gun, no ammo on the gun. One target left, I think. Oh fuck a baby! Explode the man. Wee hoo hoo! Mm -mm -mm. A rusty toasty Turian. Uh, we probably should, we probably actually should have gone upstairs. Right. Okay. There's explosives here, fucking hell. Right, okay, uh, let's go back. Let's go back and do an up, uh, upstairs sweep. Clear the upstairs area for any shit that isn't nailed down. Look, the Blue Suns have already killed them. There's no shame in looting their bodies now, or their homes, or everything. Yeah, we should have came up here. This is a much better vantage point. Uh, med kit open. How you doing? Circuit boards? Oh yeah, salvage a thousand credits. Yeah, yeah, this would have been a much better vantage point. Fuck! Okay. Anyway, it is what it is. Lesson learned. So I think I'd be more inclined to use the snow, the snow blind rounds, if it wasn't for the fact that I have to. Uh, oh god. Um, if, if it wasn't for the fact that I have to go through the shields, and this being insanity difficulty, we're having to encounter, uh, um, uh, yeah, we're, we are encountering, uh, shields more often than not. Um, so I think I might prefer to keep my shield ripper rims on. I don't really have a good solution against armor. Okay, here's some more apartments. Or is this just one per- oh fuck. Well, they're here. Shit, this is a nice apartment actually. Fucking hell. Uh, I'm stealing your first aid kit, don't worry about it. Ah, oh, fuck. Oh well, I'm stealing 100 credits from your first aid kit. Oh, thank god, you're human. Okay. I saw that door open, we thought those Turians had found us. Alright, we're just, uh, we're just looting. How are you doing? Ever since this plague started, the Blue Suns have been out to get us. They're killing as many people as the disease. Oh no, why are they after you? Why are the Blue Suns hunting you? We didn't do anything. Pretty much every non-human in the district wants us dead. They think we caused the plague. Humans aren't getting sick, and that's all the evidence they need. God knows how many of us they've already killed. They should be looking at the Vorcha, not us. 
Ever since the plague hit, they've been taking over Blue Sun's territory. Hmm. Yeah. You said the Vorcha moved in just after the plague hit? Somebody else said that too. The district was quarantined. Vorcha are immune to diseases, so they're not getting sick. Not sure where they came from. Never saw many Vorcha around before. Sure seemed like they were ready for this. Only nobody thinks the Vorcha are smart enough to create a virus like this. The Blue Suns need someone else to blame. Like us. Hmm, fair enough. You said the Vorcha were taking over Blue Suns territory? Trying to. The Blue Suns don't go down easy. The plague softened them up, but they still have enough firepower to hold some of their turf. That they do. Turians are getting pushed back. The deeper you go into the district, the more Vorcha you'll see. Unless they see you first. Fair enough. What else can you tell me about the plague? When did it start? The first cases cropped up about two weeks ago. Nobody paid much attention until it started to spread. Usually takes about a week to kill you, but it spreads fast. Three days after the first outbreak, there were over 50 known cases. That's when everyone noticed humans weren't getting sick. Then the quarantine came down and everything went to hell. Hmm. Sad. Is it airborne? Any idea how the victims contracted it? Not sure. Probably airborne. Even after the Blue Suns started sealing victims up inside their own apartments, the plague kept spreading. Now they just gun victims down and burn the bodies in the streets. Doesn't seem to be helping, though. People are dying by the dozens. Unlucky. Tell me more about the Blue Suns. They're a mercenary gang, mostly Turian. Used to run this district. Kept things nice and stable for the most part. As long as you paid your monthly protection fees, everything was cool. Rates were pretty reasonable. For Omega, at least. <laughs> this damn plague hit. Everyone started dying. The Vorta started moving in. The Blue Suns lost control and the whole district turned into a war zone. Quite. Go, all right. I need to find Morden Solus. Oh, yeah. Him. He's got a clinic on the other side of the district. Heard he's taking in refugees now. Trying to help plague victims. Offering protection from the Suns and the Vorcha. Sure. A doctor with military-grade mechs helping people for free. On Omega, grow up. Hmm. Sounds like you don't think much of the doctor in his clinic. The Vorcha tried to muscle in. He gunned them down. Just like that. Pop, pop, pop. Didn't even use his mechs. Respectable. Then the Blue Suns heard he was sheltering humans and they went to burn down the clinic. He killed them too. Then he went inside and got back to work. He's cold. Must be Solarian Special Forces or something. Hmm, fair enough. Well then, uh... I think these guys were perfectly safe here until I brought down their door, so... I have to go. Go on, get out of here. You're just drawing attention to our hiding spot. Ooh, wall safe. Can I loot it? Yes, I can! <laughs> Fucking just looting. <laughs> looting live people, let's go! Alright, got it. I should be ready. Okay. Ooh, modified That's assault rifle. Yay! Uh, okay, let's open. Here, what's a coffin? Uh... Oh, oh, they're fighting. Oh lord, they're fighting. Enemy Turian. Fuck, I missed. <laughs> oh lord. Hargrove Varen, let's go. Okay, so we seem to have landed in the middle of a fucking firefight. Good shot. So Vorcha are easier to kill on account of them not having shields. I say bravely as they don't fucking appear to sit down. Oh Lord Varen! <laughs> okay, my bad. Uh, right, okay, let's go. Where are we going? Where are we going? Fuck you, Vorcha! Is there still mercenaries down there? Oh, that's how you. Jesus Christ, that's how you. 
Oh, Krogan! Whoa! What the fuck? <laughs> How the fuck did that... <laughs> Fucking Vorcha Space Program, motherfuckers! <laughs> Fucking outrageous. <laughs> yeah, I wonder. Well, I was gonna say, I wonder if we should have been able to keep the um, the Blue Suns alive for longer, but I don't think we actually would have been able to keep them alive for much longer than we did in the end. I fucking love that that Vorcha has just gone absolutely no scant. So back you with the dance floor. I'm infected by the sand. Right, okay, unity. Okay, I'm not really sure what we've got going on here. That's um, right, you. Could you fucking get cooked? I would like you to just fucking die. That is unacceptable. Oops, shit. Did not want. Eat flamen! Uh, Miranda, bippity boppity, get your ass back up upon this property! Okay. Uh. Fuck, I knew that Krogan was still fucking around somewhere! Oh, Zaid's dead again. Right, let's get down and steal some of those fucking things. Nine, nine. Okay, good. We should have ammo. Let's reload this. Whoa! I did not expect that to be that aggressive. Right through the head hole. It seems we've crossed into Vorture territory. Yes. The Blue Suns have given up a lot of turf. Just what I like to see. Oh, shut the fuck up, Zai. You just annoy my happiness. Uh, okay, the objective is over this way. Let's go and take a tentative check of what this apartment is. So we didn't die during that fight. So I think I think we're getting I think we're getting better at this, folks. Uh, okay, let's sweep the room. Clear left and right. Ooh, refine these. Okay, this looks like somebody's house. Oh, litters, great. <laughs> I say looters as if we've not been the ones doing the looting. Let's go, let's go and say hello to them. Pop a gap in their eyelids. Hey, how you doing? What did I say? We found this stuff. It's ours. Ah, forget it. Nothing but junk in here. This place is worse than the last one. What are you doing in this apartment? Did you kill that Turian? What, the guy on the floor? Nah, the plague took care of him. That. We're just here to take a full accounting of all his worldly possessions. Hmm. I don't like looters, even though I am one. Stealing from the dead. What's the big deal? It's not like they're gonna miss anything. We're just showing a little entrepreneurial spirit. The plague doesn't affect you. And that's so why humans like are getting that. shot by the blue Besides, suns. If we don't take this stuff, the Vorcha or Blue Suns will. Better us than them, right? No. No more looting. Oh what? You're gonna shoot us? This plague won't last forever. When the Blue Suns come back, they won't like you looting in their territory. Yeah, well, maybe they won't find out. It's not like there's any witnesses alive to tell them. Are some dead Turian's trinkets and a handful of credits worth that risk? We just wanted to make a bit of quick cash. But when you put it like that, it doesn't sound like such a good idea. 
Yeah. Haven't found anything valuable anyway. Yeah, you're probably right. It's not worth it. We need to get going. Yeah, sure. Just... Don't worry, you made your point. We ain't gonna steal nothing. All right, let's go. So we've got no more first aid kits to get our teammates up if they die. That is problematic. We do need to try and get some more if we can. Uh, Cause no doubt that is not gonna be the last fight that we're gonna see. Got one of these, so we're nice and exposed over to the right. So let's just keep. The good looking things. Uh, Oxera. Uh, no sign of enemy enemy contact, so let's progress. Open the door. Ooh, clinic. One wonders if this do be Mr. Morden's clinic. God, I hope so, because I'm tired of him. Oh, fuck. Clinic guard. Okay, good. Max. Hey, how you doing? No funny business once you're in the clinic, unless you want to deal with those Max. Arrangeable. Okay, let's uh, let's let's go meet Martin. Done. All clear here. Clinic receptionist. Morton's around here somewhere. Uh, go talk to him. We need all the help we can get. Arrangeable. Sorry, too busy to stop and chat. You should go find Morton. Also arrangeable. Jesus Christ. There's so many, so many people. The fuck are you? Oh, you're a guard. This clinic is a sanctuary. If you're looking for trouble, go somewhere else. Wow, rude. On our way here, we saw humans looting the apartments of the dead. It made me sick. Don't worry, we stopped them. I didn't realize how good things were in the district before the quarantine. Never thought I'd miss the blue suns. Oh, is this a decontamination room? Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. Uh, okay, fine. Now let's go talk to the patient. Morton saved my life. I owe him everything. Oh, sounds like he's close to here, then. Yes, sir. We're working on some poxy. It's pure collateral. Plenty on hand. Almost as good. Causes cramping in the pterians. Supplement with butemerol. Now here, the butemerol. Got it. Senazine is the catalyst. Bonds to genetic markers. Hard to find. Expensive to mass produce. Why not Hepacor? Too unstable, inconsistent results. Demazine, better option. No, no, no. Demazine, toxic to humans. Not an option. Not an option. I do like Martin. So basically, his mind runs at about four million like thoughts per second. <laughs> Laughing up. Let's get. Palladium. This should come in handy. Yay! Yeah, so Morton's got like a very eccentric talking style that I quite like, to be honest. Ooh, refined easel, iridium easel. Oh. Good shit. Oh god, you can see the people in the background from the corner. Anyway, uh, let's talk to let's talk to Mr. Morton. I don't know if I don't I don't, I don't think this patient seems alive to be. I don't think this patient seems perfectly alive. <laughs> oh well, what can you do? Morden! Hello, how you doing? Professor Morden Solis? Hmm. Don't recognize you from area. Too well armed to be refugees. No mercenary uniform. Quarantine still in effect. Here for something else. Borcha? Crew to clean them out? Unlikely. Borcha a symptom, not a cause. The plague. Investigating possible use as bioweapon. No, no, no. Too many guns. Not enough data equipment. I'm so not fucking renegating Morden. Yes, yes. Hide guns. Maybe. Keep Relax, us. Morden. I'm Commander Shepard, and I came here to find you. I'm on a critical mission, and I need your help. Mission? What mission? No, 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 no. Too busy. Clinic understaffed. Plague spreading too fast. Who sent you? Mm. Ever heard of an organization called Cerberus? Crossed paths on occasion. Thought they only work with humans. Why request Salarian aid? The collectors are kidnapping entire human populations. We're gonna find out why and stop them. Yeah, we are. Collectors, interesting. Play kidding these slums is engineered. Collectors, one of few groups with technology to design it. Our goals may be similar. But right. must stop plague first. Already have a cure. Need to distribute it at environmental control center. Borcha guarding it. Need to kill them. Hmm. Arrangeable. I'll get in and deal with the Borcha. 
sounded troubling. Borgia have shut down environmental systems. Trying to kill everyone. Need to get power back on before district suffocates. Here, take play cure. Also, bonus in good faith. Weapon from dead blue sun's marks may come in handy against Borgia. One more thing. Daniel, one of my assistants, went into Borgia territory looking for victims. Hasn't come back. I'll give an eye. <laughs> but he is probably dead. I'll do what I can to help. He is probably dead. Thank you. Told him not to go. But he's smart. Bright future. I hope. Uh, yeah. I found a Batarian plague victim near the entrance to the neighborhood. Can you send someone to help him? Hmm. Risky. Blue Suns, Borcha still battling. District not secure. See what I can do. Okay. Uh, right. Let's have a look here. What can you tell me about this plague? Hmm. Advanced design. Suspected collectors before you mentioned them. Purpose seems experimental. Destroys respiratory systems with harmful genetic mutations. Hmm. Makes sense to avoid humans. Unnecessary to force mutation on human genetic structure for sake of variance. Unnecessary mutations? What are you talking about? Possible goal of virus. Testing viable mutation levels in various species. Horrific, but feasible for collectors. Humans known to have diverse genetic background, wider range than other sapient races. Makes sense as control group. Hmm. Fair enough. Uh, Vorcha. What do you know about the Vorcha? Cowardly, opportunistic scavengers. Not tactical or aggressive. Scale of attack unusual for them. They are Suspect aggressive. Vorcha working yeah. for collectors. Distributing plague, collecting data. No proof, but... Theory fits evidence. Fair. Yeah. Any idea where I can find Daniel? No. Heard infected Batarians trapped behind Borcha lines. Daniel went to help. Warned him not to go. Too dangerous. Patients here need him. Stuck out anyway. Wanted to find him myself. Can't leave the clinic. Have to look after the patients. Right. Um, okay, let's have a look at the attacks in the clinic. See what's going on there. The clinic? Nothing major. Blue Suns gave her humans. Made threats. Killed them before things escalated. <laughs> That's nothing major. For a doctor, you're awfully calm about taking out a group of mercs. Wasn't always a doctor. Some work with Solarian Special Tasks Group. Can handle myself. Yeah, hey, look how happy he is. Turians, Krogan, Borcha, all obvious threats. Never see me coming. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 I love Martin. Martin is great. Uh, oh, a hand cannon acquired. Yes. Okay, right, let's go. So let's go to the weapon station and see what we can get. So, Shepherd. Let's look at this. So, the Predator is what we had. The Hand Cannon's now what we've got. We'll look at Miranda. She, so, she's been automatically upgraded as well. Oh, you've got a Vindicator Sniper Rifle. Oh, okay, okay, fine. Uh, right, let's go. So, we should be able to go out here now. This is probably the safest place in the district right now. We intend to keep it that way. Yes, quite. Okay, right. Guns out there, ready? No, oh, I hear Varcha. Fuck! Is that in the background there? Yeah, that's a Varcha. Uh, right, good cover here. Let's just open this fight up. Oh, no, that didn't kill him. That didn't kill him. Wiggy, wiggy, motherfucker. Hostiles. Yeah, can we please deal with that pyro? I'm scared of pyros after the last fucking thing. We had to deal with. Have a great supply of ammo for this fight. Oh god, there's a Krogan, there's a Krogan, there's a Krogan, there's a Krogan. Oh lord, there's a fucking Sparcha right there. Okay, Whoa! Bippity boppity, evacuate the property! Uh, okay, yeah, you stay there. Taking fire. Fuck a dick! Could you. Fucking not. Incoming. If it's all the same to you, you piece of scrub skin. Okay, we can just see you. Yeah, you'll do whatever the fuck you want, sunshine, but while you're here, you'll fucking die. Okay, let's punish ammo. Let's try and deal with this Krogan. Come on, reload. Reload one up. Uh, let's get some flamin' on him. Oh lord, the gun wasn't cocked! Ah! Oh lord, let's put the hand cannon to use! Oh. 
Fuck you, you piece of waffle. Oh, fuck. No! I didn't need to die there, but I ran the wrong way. Fuck! You checking on my desk there, Badger? didn't need to die there. Oh no, you ruined it. Yeah, I ruined it by dying. How unfortunate of me. Okay, right, actually change of plan here. Right, let's let's get you, rid of you to start this engagement. Moving to cover. Taking cover! Enemies in front! Here we go! Hey, Mr. Borcha! I would recommend... Oh lord, hello. Yeah, can we just inflam in this man? Kill the Krogan, kill the Krogan, kill that Krogan now! Fuck you, motherfucker! Okay, that's good for Okay, there's two over there. Miranda, stop being, stop being sexually degenerate. Okay, can we at least... Somehow, if... oh, fuck a dick. Oh, damn, I just shot that poor Vorcha's childhood memories out. Uh, you, be in flaming. Ah, blew up a wall, fuck. Oh, damn, John, he did. With you. Okay. You Looks like we're all clear. Oh, no, we're not, we're not all clear at all. Boop! Dead, Forge is dead. Uh, right, I've got one bullet left, that is unfortunate. Are they just burning bodies again? Yes. Oh, Lord! Oh. I do quite like the power of this sniper rifle. Like, when you take that shot, you can just feel the memories flying out the back of their skull. Oh, fuck, I think you're... Affirmative. I can cover. Quite. Can I reload this gun so that I can pop a cap in yo ass, motherfucker? <clears throat> oh, shit, I missed that shot. <laughs> Problematic. What? No. Why did that change location? What the fuck? Inflammen! Oh, I'm stuck on something. Oh, fuck a hooker with another hooker. I don't want to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with a pyro. Come on, take it, take it off, take it off, take it off. Ooh. Mm. Or just turn to giblets, either way. Either fucking way, sunshine. Uh, right, okay, uh, right. Let's very quickly do a quick rapid search for... For shit. I do generally frown upon genocide, but uh, not when it's uh, not when it's involving saving other people. Well, how do you know that's true? That's uh, <laughs> that's not true. But no, you do feel like you get through a lot of bodies in these things. Anything over here? Oh, gambling terminal. Uh, oh fuck! I hate this mini game. Uh, 
you? Yes. I got the hat done. Give me them three thousand dollars. Yeah, boy. Okay, great, fine. Uh, let's get up these stairs then and try and get towards this water place. Uh, oh, can hack the bank terminal. This is probably going to be another one of these bad boys. Uh, so all diagonal here. Uh, lots of purple at the bottom left. This isn't how uh, code hacking works, by the way. Uh, so you're this one, and then the last one is you. Okay, fine. Bam, bam, bam. Oh, yeah. $5,000. Yeah. We're looting the bodies. We're looting the homes. We're looting the banks. Let's fucking go. Okay, rooms on the left, rooms on the right. And here I am, stuck in the middle with you. I'm telling you the truth. I work for Morden at the clinic. Oh, shit, I came here him. to help you. We know you're spreading the plague virus. We saw the vials in your bag. No, those vials contain the cure. Please, you have to believe me. Maybe we should cut off your fingers. I should loosen your... Look out! Oh, one more step and we'll kill your friend. Nobody needs to die. I know you're scared of the Vorcha, of the plague, but this man isn't to blame. If he was spreading the virus, why would he come into Vorcha territory? They're immune. She's right. Doesn't make any sense. If we release the prisoner, we can go. You have my word on it. Let him go. You got what you wanted, human. Are we free to go? Yeah. A deal. Human nobility. I didn't know such a thing existed. Bold coming from a fucking Batarian. Fucking hell. Thank you. I thought they were gonna. Uh, Bat Batarians are the galaxy's cunts, basically. Find me? Yeah, he needs you. The professor could use your help right now. He's got too many patients and not enough volunteers. Yeah, okay. I'll go right away. Thanks again. I owe you. Well, everything. Indeed. Indeed, you do. Whoop! Uh, right. Okay. We don't need any first aid stuff at the moment. Oh, good Vartja. Who'd have fucking thunk it? Enemies in front. Here we go. Sorry, can cut this shot. Oh, that's what you seem to do. What the fuck? How did I manage to miss that shot? Uh, I wanna... I wanted to try something here. Aww. I wanted to get a good shot of Shepard firing, but uh, I think... Uh, I think it's gonna be scuffed because you've got this little fucking effect thing coming out of the gun. Anyway, I think we've, we've gone to harm Mr. here. Well, they did. They did. Uh, let's head on down here. Oh, fuck. Ah, I don't like the look of this. Yeah, I don't like the look of that either. Fuck you, Vorcha prick. Oh, he's dead. Sad, unfortunate, tragic, all that good stuff. Okay, let's keep on the high ground for just now. Let's use this. Oh, well, that didn't really work so well. Hey, Mr. Fortune. I fucking see you behind that wall. There's also one more of you over there as well. Enemies in front! <clears throat> Uh, Zaid, would you like to be productive? I would strongly suggest that you be productive here. Uh, right, let's keep the high ground just now. Uh, see, I fucking, I fucking called it. Pop goes your memories. Powerful for you, absolute waffles. I've got the power! I kind of want to move to snowblind rounds because these guys don't have shields. What with the Vorcha being Vorcha. I'll 
Break your island. Fuck you. Going now. On my way. Loud and clear. Right there. Ah, sh shit. I kind of want to keep the high ground in this fight. Zaid! Got it. You're the worst fucking mercenary I've ever seen in my fucking life, you absolute prick. On my way. Taking cover! No, you won't break me. Guys are way too shit for that. Ah, uh, that wasn't a headshot. Right, seeing as you guys are entirely useless, you guys fucking follow me and we'll see what we can do about you. Uh, not really sure. I have to go. Oh, vent we have to head towards ventilation control. That seems about right to me. Uh, so this is the staircase that we... Oh, wait, hang on. Wait, where was the staircase? Oh, I don't think I noticed that at all. Ha ha ha! Uh, right, okay. Uh, yeah, fine. Let's, uh, let's just progress. I think we are clear of Mortja and whatnot. You got it. Right behind here. you. Uh, right, fine. Let's, let's yeah, let's head towards ventilation control and see what we can. No, oh, oh, okay, we're fine. All right, quick save and let's advance. You know, I've done well not dying in a while. I bet you we're just gonna absolutely get destroyed if we go through this door. Oh lord! Hey, Mr. Krogan! Fuck. I was going to say, Miranda, see if you fucking ate that by accident, I was not going to be happy. Here goes. Oh. <sighs> Poor Mr. Krogan's lived for like several hundred years and, you know, now he did. Okay, so this is ventilation control up here. Let's make sure that there's nothing of any value over here, which there is, thousands, uh, we're probably not going to use this, so let's just that. Uh, oh, cool, it's a garage over there. Right, uh, fine, let's get up to, oh, come on. The environmental controls should be nearby. We need to insert the cure, then reactivate the fans. Don't we just, Miranda? Don't we just need to do a whole bunch of- You don't come here! We shut down machines! Break fans! That- Everyone choke and die! Then collectors make us strong! What the fuck are you doing? What do the collectors want? <sighs> collectors want plague! You work for doctor! Turn on machines! Put cure in air! We kill you first! Here we go. Yeah. I will shoot your childhood memories, clean out your fucking head. We're gonna have to defend this for a while, aren't we? Okay, let's get the cure insert. Excellent. The cure is in place. Now we need to reactivate the fans. <clears throat> wow, this doesn't seem like it's gonna take a while at all. Uh, how does one reactivate the fans? Oh no 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 Affirmative Yes quite Right there 
That wasn't a very tactically sound. Oh my kidding, T Gooseyus. Why the fuck, Knuckles, is there so many Varcher? There's so many fucking rocket launchers. Move right. You guys hold there. Sand control? No. Oh, oh lord. I may need assistance here. Eat one of these. Oh shit, no ammo. Fuck. Ten out of ten did not want points. I got it. Okay, good. Move up, move up, move up. Affirmative. Got it. Oh well, sad. He's dead. Okay, where the fuck is the fan control? Okay, here we go. Fan controls. This is powering back up. Still need to activate the other one. Yep. Okay. Arrangeable. Night night. Miranda, your military prowess knows no bad just fucking standing up against a wall being shot for absolutely no reason. Oh! Fuck a dick. What the knuckles? Right, Zaid. Zaid, you're a bit of a liability right now. Go back to your uh, go back to your machine. Change weapons. Yeah, if we could please Not just, uh, fuck shit out of this gentleman. I see this him. absolute crow again. You got oh, damn, you got son, that felt brutal. Oh, fuck. Whoop -up. I want nothing to do with any of that. Uh, however, this is going to be really a lot harder to, uh, I need to... Oh lord! Okay, reload. Let's go to this, and pop! Reload again, and be ready for him to come up. Pop! Dodge that rocket, we are absolutely Gucci to go for you. Yeah, and then Mr. Mr. Fucking Crow. Right Loud and clear. Yeah, quite. Can you guys deal with that, please? Oh, damn, son. Uh, right, give me that hand cannon, eh? Heads up! He's charging! He ain't charging no more! Taking right. Struggling for ammo here. Heads up! Perfect! Firing now. Wah. Flamin! Oh shit, those guys just got fucking executed. What the fuck? <laughs> uh, thanks for the lurk, Steve's Game Dump. Thank you. Fucking died. Oh fuck, let's just take me back to. You don't come here. We shut down machines, break fans. Yep, yeah, yeah. Everyone choke and die. What the collect? Let's see you, Shepard. Let's see you, Shepard. Shaking that ass. Shaking that ass. Shaking that ass. Right, you guys get here. Going to cover. Taking cover. Oh, damn. Man, man, gone done exploding. Right. Reinitialize the systems there. Moving to cover. Taking cover. 
Please take cover. Uh, you keep your thing out. Uh, what what alternative gun do you have? Pretty yeah, you can you keep that. Cure glorious cure. Excellent. The cure is in place. Now we need to reactivate the fan. This will put them down. Peaceful when they're not shooting at me. Right, let's get the fan control up and running. Gotcha. Heading to cover. Heading cover. Right, let's get these guys in position. Because if they're in position for a fight, right, before they actually start spawning, which you'll be now. So if we now, now if we do this. Fucking get flammed, bitch. And he just all around had a bad time. He didn't goes. He? Engaging target. Heading to cover. Aren't you just, man? Though? Aren't you fucking just? Okay, good work. Uh, right, you guys. So let, let's try and do this a wee bit more tactically sound. Zaid here, Miranda here. So we can't take a quick save during any of this. We just have to. We just have to deal with it like that. Still need to activate the other one. No, Miranda, why, why, why did you leave? Miranda, why leave? Not that one. You bet. Here. Uh, Zaid, wakey, wakey. Wakey, wakey, you kill it. Taking position. Going now. Affirmative. On my way. We're compromised. Yeah, we bet. Jesus Christ, did you just blow fucking. You fellow boy. Right, good shit, good shit, let's go. What the fuck, a dick? That is an abusive amount of explosives. Well, Miranda's dead. Uh, Miranda, wiggy wiggy. We will, in fact, need you for this fight. I would recommend that, yes. Oh lord. Stop being dead, please. What the fuck? How did I miss that shot? Standing in the open is not a good idea. Okay, I, I'm not hot on ammo here. Okay. Right, second set of fan controls. We should be Gucci to Gucci here. Both fans are online. Morden should be pleased. Right. 
Okay, good. So it's gonna fast travel us back. Oh, thanks, Fuck for that. Engaged. Airborne viral levels dropping. Patients improving. Orchard retreating. Well done, Shepard. Thank you. And thank you for me as well. Those Batarians would have killed me. Yes, he would have, Daniel. For a second there, I thought you were going to shoot them even after they let me go. I'm not like that. I made a promise to spare them if they let you go. I honor my promises. Merciful of you. Risky. Would have killed them myself. <laughs> oh, Marden. Professor, how can you say that? You're a doctor. You believe in helping people. Eh. Lots of ways to help people. Sometimes heal patients. Sometimes execute dangerous people. Either way, <laughs> go check on the patients. Wow. Lots of work to do. Think about what I said. Wow. Good kid, bit naive. He'll learn. Letting him take over the clinic should be able to handle it now that Borja are gone. Oh, are you joining us? We've cured the plague. Are you ready to help stop the collectors? Yes. Unexpected to be working with Cerberus. Many surprises. Just need to finish up here at the clinic. Won't take long. Meet you at your ship. Looking forward to it. Yes, Martin. Okay, let's let's head away. We're heading out. See you in the Normandy. There we go. So we're done with this district. Mission complete. Level up. We're now level eight. Jesus Christ is so loud. Uh, recruited Dr. Morton Solace for the team. Examination uh, examination of Omega Plague Cure confirms Dr. Solace's expertise. Can also use work on Omega as leverage against area if necessary. Um, highly accurate and lethal sidearm. Effective against armor. Weak against shield and biotic barriers. Upgrades the Predator Heavy Pistol. That's good shit. Assault rifle damage. Med gel capacity. Credits and element zero. <laughs> and we have the Professori. Welcome to the Normandy, Professor. It's an honor to have you on board. Yes, very exciting. Cerberus working with aliens. Unexpected. Elusive man branching out, maybe? Not so human centric. Hmm, you know the elusive man? You're very well informed. Solarian government well-connected espionage experts had top-level clearance once, retired now, still hear things. Informed of name only, no knowledge of man behind it. Anti-alien reputation listed as problematic. Yeah, well, let's hope it's changed. The collectors have been abducting colonists from the fringes of the Terminus systems. No distress signals are sent out, no signs of attack. There's virtually no evidence that anything unusual happened at all. Except that every man, woman, and child is gone. Gas, maybe? No, spreads too slow. Airborne virus. You don't have to sit there and guess. <laughs> we collected samples from one of the colonies. I'd like you to analyze them and figure out how the collectors did this. Yes, of course. Analyze the samples. I'm going to need a lab. There is a fully equipped lab on the combat deck, Professor Solis. If you find anything lacking, please place a requisition order. Who's that? Pilot? No. Synthesized voice. Simulated emotional inflections. Could it be? No. Maybe. Have to ask. Is that an AI? <laughs> I love the thing. I, the thing I like about Morden, right, is this is kind of this is kind of like the thought process that my I don't say it aloud, but like I am very rapidly at uh, uh, many times just like asking myself questions and having to work up with answers with them, and like yeah, it's just that like constant stream of things. It's the reason I can't sleep at night. Ship is right. equipped with an artificial intelligence. An AI on board, non-human crew members. Cerberus more desperate than I thought. Wow. The collectors have taken tens of thousands of colonists. We'll do whatever we have to do to find and stop them. Yes, of course. Can't risk being captured like colonists need to identify, neutralize technology, need samples. Which way to the lab? Follow me, Professor. <laughs> oh, I love Martin. Martin, Martin, Martin. Uh, right, let's go ahead and... Ooh, Eviscerator Shotgun. Med gel capacity. Ah, yeah, so this is... This is this is the laboratory here. So, well, this is the fucking... I'm not sure what this little side room thing is. Uh, yeah, this is a tech lab. So this is uh, where we go to do upgrades and research uh, and we have Mordian. Can we get done that? No. no. And yeah, so let's have a wee chat to Morden now that he's on board. Shepard, how can I help? Uh, investigate, lab out. Is the lab working well for you? Quite satisfactory. Found a few surveillance bugs. 
Destroyed most of them. Returned expensive one to Miranda. Nothing unexpected. <laughs> Just need more samples. More collector data, tissue samples, anything you can get, I can use. Find new tech. Excellent. Uh, squad status. Are there any medical concerns I should be aware of on the team? Cerberus personnel in excellent condition. No squad concerns to report. Always some matters, but nothing affecting immediate mission. Yep. Uh, uh, upgrade? Any ideas on other ways to prepare for the collectors? Ideas, yes. Expensive, but possibly valuable. Can show you. Okay. So, weapon upgrades. Um, review. Ooh, armor piercing sniper rifle. Increases damage by 50% against armor. Oh, that is a good one. Oh. But we can't, we can't get this? Oh, no! Uh, Submachine gun damage might be serviceable to get. Uh, armor upgrades, med gel capacity is definitely going to be useful. Tech damage, not so much, but it's relatively cheap, so that's fine. Chip enhancement prototypes. Cerberus assault armor. Shit. Collector assault rifle, collector chitin armor, heavy weapon ammo, negotiation bonus 10%. Oh god. Aww. Let me yeah. know if upgrades seem feasible. Can install them whenever you like. Arrangeable. Uh, let's have a chat about you. Got a minute to talk? Of course. Plague on Omega dealt with plenty of time to analyze collector intelligence. Impressive laboratory setup. Missed working for operations with the budget. AI in particular, very helpful. Best setup I've seen since work with Special Tasks Group. <laughs> uh. It must have been frustrating working on Omega with such a limited facility. No, nope. loved it. Limited facility presents challenge. Save greatest number of people using limited resources. Security threats, gangs, mercenary groups add additional difficulty. Quite enjoyable. Plague stretched abilities to limit. Couldn't have asked for more. Also, <laughs> enjoy saving people, of course. Helping the helpless, greater good, all that too. Nice. Retirement after SDG work complete. <laughs> I love Morden! I love my SDG. Tell me more about the Solarian Special. I love Morden so much. Respected organization. Clandestine. Handles difficult assignments with limited oversight. Recon, analysis, occasional wet work, identify problems, have neutralization Dang. options ready should need arise. Model for council specters based on special tasks group. Very similar. Oh, excellent. Similar in what way? Solarians lack numbers, brute strength, military prowess, have to rely upon stealth, intelligence. Agents trusted given wide operative freedom. Specters similar, given goal, told to accomplish. Better <laughs> funded, of course. <laughs> Didn't have to buy our own weapons. <laughs> Uh, how's your assistant doing? Any word on your assistant? Is your assistant Daniel settling in all right? Quite well. Safe and secure. Neighborhood mostly quiet with plague gone. Left him the security mechs just in case. Can't be too careful. Also tired of mechs. Noisy. Never used them in STG. Ah. You said you were in the special tasks group. What kind of research were you doing? Not simply research. Several recon missions. Covert. High risk. Served under young captain named Kirihi. Studied Krogan genophage, took water, tissue samples from Krogan colonies. Uh, yeah. I, uh, I met Kirihi. I worked with an STG captain named Kirihi. His team helped me destroy Saren's cloning facility on Burmire. Heard he was part of that. Jury rigged explosive. Hm. Always got job done with limited resources. Good captain. Bit of a cloaca, though. Love his bitches. <laughs> Hold the line. Personally prefer to get job done and go home. Probably military bravado. Jargon. Chest pounding. Uh, no offense. <laughs> Why would STG study the genophage? Krogan rebellion's bloody, dangerous, nearly as bad as Rachni attacks. Mm, All species adjust. fall, adapt, mutate. If genophage weakens, need to be prepared. Bird high. What was the STG preparing to do? Military schematics for likely Krogan population growth. Political scenarios for attack points. Genophage reduced Krogan numbers. Species aggression unchecked. Population explosion would be disastrous. STG helped check Krogan rebellions. Needed to be ready to do the same. Simple recon. Nothing to worry about. <laughs> what can you tell me about the genophage? Bioweapon designed by Solarian science team. Deployed by Turians against Krogans to end Krogan rebellions more than a thousand years ago. Affects every cell of Krogan body. Commonly and incorrectly considered a sterility plague. 
actually adjusts viable fertility rates to compensate for high Krogan birth rate, stabilizes to pre-industrial population growth levels. Hmm. Well then. Nice talking with you, Morden. I should get back to work. Need to study. So much data. So Here, much data. Excellent. Right, so we've got a few more things to do today, uh, and then uh, we will be calling it a thing. So research terminal. So if we look at weapon upgrades, so I think we don't want weapon upgrades just now. Morden's Omni tool we will take. Yay! Uh, armor upgrades. No. Uh, weapon upgrade. Oh no, I can't, I can't get that one. I really did want that one. 10% um, submachine gun damage. We've got a good amount of iridium, so let's. Uh, can we just keep going with this? No, okay. So we, we can only do this. Okay, I think we've got enough ir iridium to get through all of this. Uh, armor upgrades, I think. Do this, and then tech damage trauma module. Ooh, unity school. Okay, that's a good ship. Ship enhancement, we don't have any yet. Okay, let's look at heavy, ooh, heavy bone wheat. Uh, we need, we do need more palladium. Um, yeah, okay, I don't think there's anything else I necessarily want here. I really don't want to change off the M7 armor, but, uh, yeah. Uh, let's look at, um, let's look at the heavy, yeah, heavy weapon ammo upgrade. Probably going to be helpful. Um, okay, fine. So tech damage, submachine gun damage. Yeah, so that's all the stuff that we've done. Fine. Um, okay, so we need to go downstairs to have a look, uh, to have a wee chat with our engineering team. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Fan fucking tastic. Let's go to engineering. Uh, so we're going to talk with our engineering team to see how they're settling and with the new upgrades to the ship that we bought. Quite helpful. Quite helpful indeed. Heard. Collectors hit the Ferris Fields colony. Everyone's gone. Oh. Shit. We're going to make those dirty buggers pay. We're gonna make the dirty buggers pay. It's fucking outstanding. Somebody pointed out it was an American or Canadian actor who's who, who does engineer Donnelly. It's just so aggressively over the top. Like, just. We're gonna make the dirty buggers pay. You're the best, Commander. We just got those FBA couplings installed. Now we only have to calibrate every week instead of every day. Happy We're fucking days. We're about celebrating our newfound free time with some Skillion 5 poker. Want to join us? Come on, Kenneth. The Commander doesn't want to play cards with grease monkeys like us. <laughs> I would play. Actually, that sounds interesting. Fantastic. I'll get the cards. <laughs> My Skillion 5's a bit rusty. It'll be easy on the rookie, right? Of course, Commander. It's all friendly. Yeah, right. <laughs> Woo! Five hundred credits. Oh, they're not gonna be happy. Be gentle on the rookie. I can't believe we fell for that. <laughs> it's so worth losing to see you taken down a notch. Beat me up my own game. You're all right, Shepard. <laughs> That's funny. That is funny. What can we do for you, Commander? Uh, yeah. Carry on. Will do, Commander. That was funny. I, I quite enjoyed that. Uh, right, let's go to the. No, fuck, that's the wrong deck. I forget there's a. I forget there's a deck. Although we can get to see our new ship now, which is pretty cool. Look, we got two new ships. Uh, oh wait, this is. I've been spending so long on Red Dead. I forgot this one fucking Red Dead. I can't just press V a few times when I go first person. Uh, but what I can do is go into photo mode, actually, now that I think about it. Uh, okay, so basically what we've got now is you've got yourself a, uh, a Turian cruiser, the Normandy 2, and then a wee Geth dropship. Here I go. Uh, so let's go to the CIC, if that's all good. No messages for you, Commander. Fields. Any 
news on your brother? He's gone. They're all gone. But we'll get them back. Shepard and Lawson are on it. We'll get your brother back. And make sure the collectors pay for taking him. Aw, bless. Sad. Can I just leave into... No, okay. So, I'm still parked at Omega. Not that you would fucking know it. Oh, wait. Yeah. Alright, thanks. Commander. I assume everything's going well up here? I really want a chance to put the Normandy through her paces. I just had to trim up the drive output and it'll be like we never lost her. Safety standards advise against manipulating drive settings while engines are powered and in use, Mr. Moreau. Commander, can we shut this thing off? I don't need it in my day-to-day. Ah, -day. Uh, dear. <laughs> you don't want to hear it. Turn the damn sound off. Well, that doesn't change anything. It's still watching. Like some cool <laughs> kid staring at the back of your head in comp side. You just want to punch him, but he's special and he sets fires or something. <laughs> not get a little too far there, but you know what I mean. <laughs> no problem, not mine. Thanks. I'll remember this. Wow. That's it for now. See you, Commander. So we've got to go and uh, we've got to go. We've, we've got to go to Omega. We, we need to double check in. So I think I think we should I think we should replenish our probes before we before we do this. Well, sorry, we should we should uh, fucking. Uh, what do we need? It's palladium that we really need, isn't it? See, there you go, palladium. Probe launched. Is that about as much as we need? Yeah, that's about as much as we need. Go. Um, okay, let's, uh... So this should let me get the weave. So we took quite a lot of damage. Uh, uh oh, heavy bone weave. What do you mean I can't? What do you mean I can't? Huh? Do not need to, what requires one or more, but we got a heavy. What we got a heavy? We we fucking. Well, fuck you, cunt. <laughs> we did get a heavy weave. <sighs> Fine. Right, let's go speak to Aria, check our messages, and then we might finally be done with the system. For now. Uh, right. Omega and orbit. Yeah. We skipped it. Yeah, okay, we can, okay, we've seen it like three times today. So we want to hand that data pad to Aria. Let's go for. Uh, let's go for Morden and Garus. Wait, can we? Oh wait, hang on, cancel. Can we? Oh, uh, Morden doesn't have another appearance. Big sad. Big sad indeed. Um, there you go. You can see my grey shepherd starting to show a little bit there. Um, okay, so we've got two. Bad. Um, not sure what I want. Um, yeah, I think incinerate's more useful. Oh, we can get AI hacking. Oh, yay! That's pretty tasty. Uh, right, let's look at. Uh, let's look at. Garrus, and there's nothing that we can do there, and Morden, there's gonna be nothing that we can do there as well. Okay, cool. Uh, fine, let's have a look at Mashuf. Not really much options here. Uh, what's Morden's weapon? So he is hand cannon and machine pistol, that's fine. Okay, fine, let's go. Uh, right, so we need to go talk to Arya. Uh, which... So I think we'll have a wee chat in the marketplace. Um, see if there's anything that we've missed in the shops that we can possibly now afford. Is that lady gone? Yeah, she has. So that was the way to the quarantine zones, which we now can't get back to, which is fine, which is fine, that's fine. 
Uh, right, Mad Prophet. Oh, there's some blue suns. Let's have a look at this here. So, capacitor chest plate. Yeah. Uh, hack module. Doubles the time limit for a hack. So, we can afford that. What is a black storm? Oh. Is this a heavy weapon? I can't wait really to So, yeah. What's this? I think we'll purchase the hack module. Uh, let's just see. Oh, wait, what? Originally created for Earth's Urban Combat Championship League, armor has. Uh, when and how the elusive man got his hands on the armor is unknown, but several of the signatures bear the message, such as Expletive the Get and Shepherd Get Well Soon. Wow. Well. Okay, I don't think. Um, I don't think we've got. I'll need to have a look and see what we can do with armors, actually, because on, on one hand, on one hand, I like the N7 armor, but on the other, uh, I do also have to be mindful of the fact that this is an insanity playthrough, and uh, I need every edge that I can get. Come on, let me in. Let me in. Hey, how you doing? Come on. Bum ba da bee ba da bum bum bee. Uh, let's look at the, oh, look at the journal. Oh, no, okay, we don't have a journal apparently. We do have a journal. Cool. Uh, right, fine. So let's uh, let's go talk to Aria. We're back into nightclub territory, so I'm having a sh. I feel like you can't hear me, but I think you can hear me. Okay. Oh, does she? Hey, Ari, how's it going? What do you need? Take a look at this data pad. data pad was on one of the mercs going after Archangel. They were coming for you next. Let me see. Hmm. Interesting. Would someone like to tell me <laughs> Thanks for the heads up, Shepard. Looks like I'll have to do a little cleaning in my organization. Uh, indeed. Tell me how you got set up here. That's as privileged as information gets. Fair enough. I have many friends and enemies I keep at varying distances. I don't count you among either. We'll see how useful you are. Fair enough. Short answer? Mind your own damn. Maybe I'll come back later. Maybe I'll be here. <laughs> Maybe I'll be here. Aria has a job she needs doing. You up for some work? Sure. It depends on what Aria has in mind. Aria's gotten word that some blood packed mercs plan to kill an old acquaintance of hers. A Krogan named Patriarch. Oh no! She'd like you to keep that from happening. Uh, I know Patriarch. What's the blood pack's problem with Patriarch? If you've met Patriarch, you know. Can't keep his damn mouth <laughs> shut. Some people don't appreciate his story, especially when he dips into non-fiction. Fair enough. I'll look into it. Oh, Rally! Thank you so much for the sub. Thank you. Get him into hiding until the mercs move on. Come back here when it's done, and you'll get your due. Yeah. Okay. I'll be back when the job's done. Good luck. Uh. And tell him he needs to hide. Okay, let's go find Patriarch. So we know where he is because we met him earlier. Helena Blake, that bin, you know. You had a good day there, Alec. Thank you so much for the sub. It's uh, very kind of you. Oh, fuck. 
Oh yeah, I forget the music changes halfway down the stairs. Uh, right, so he should be in. I love just turning into the fucking. I, I love the idea of turning up to a nightclub with a fucking grenade launcher. Like. You again. Greetings. Right, uh, you do have any enemies. Some people want you dead. I've been asked to move you to safety. Well, of course. Aria wouldn't want me hurt. It would make her look bad. Right, wouldn't it just? Aria's reputation is no longer my concern. <laughs> Perhaps I will stay. See who thinks me important enough to kill. Oh, let's see what this does. Here's an idea. Let me handle the assassins for you. And so your name grows, while I remain an old man who lets others Aww. fight his battle. No, you remain a powerful warlord with forces at his command, not just Aria's trophy. You could, you could be my Grant, fighting for my honor. If you would do this for me, I would be grateful. I might even be a Krogan again. Oh, patriarch. <laughs> Flame door me. Oh my. Well, just an execution. That was that was that was just ugh. Oh, oh my. Oh, Borcha. Borcha adaptation interesting. Not just biological, social as well. Hmm. Urban area adapting to them in return. Large concentration. Hope they're controlled. If they attack, as happened near my clinic, casualties likely. Quite. Usually when people attack, casualties are likely, that is true. Good news. You killed them all. And everyone knows that the Patriarch is not to be Oh, crushed. look how happy he Thanks is. You, Arya may think of me as more than a trophy. A real advisor, maybe. Or even a friend. Take care, Patriarch. First time. I like that name. <laughs> By the way, be careful with Aria. She will approve of what you've done, I think. But not of you altering the balance of Omega. I think it reminds her too much of herself. Yeah. <laughs> maybe. Maybe, Patriarch. Maybe. Uh, speak to Grizz. Yeah, okay. What? Has there been an explosion here? What the fuck? Hey, Helena. What happened to his daughter now? Hello again, Commander. I have to go. Of course. You must have more important things to do. Oh, I do. No. Uh, Chris. Maria wants to speak with you. This is where she paid the blood pack assassins to kill him. 100% calling it right now. Word has it that Patriarch's Krant took out the men set here to kill him. Funny I didn't know he had a Krant. Eh. Uh. Patriarch has more influence than you thought. I see. Well, maybe I should watch my back then. Maybe you should, bitch. It's not what I asked, but you got the job done. done a lot for me, Shepard. Let me return the favor. We're sending your coordinates to a cache on an uncharted world. You want it? It's yours. Oh, well, thank you. We can use any help we can get. Whatever you find is yours to deal with. I can respect that. Thought I have him with Patriarch. Sounds like you and Patriarch have a history. 
Our history is Omega's history. Long, bloody, and always ending in my favor. <laughs> the details are complicated. Aren't they just? When I arrived, Omega was lawless, a land of opportunity. I built alliances and destroyed the fools who wouldn't get mine, which was most of them. Fair enough. Patriarch was something different. A powerful friend. I'm surprised you were ever anything but rivals. We were allies for a hundred years. I suppose he decided that was long enough. Wasn't a surprise <laughs> when he turned. He controlled the muscle. My people contributed more subtle action. Espionage, politics. I'm the stripper in the background just having a wild time. <laughs> His men had become accustomed to certain benefits from working with Asari. Oh. Superior intel? Assassination? That's cute. No, I took advantage of certain skills my people try to downplay. Patriarch's men abandoned him Babes. in droves. In the end, we fought face to face on this very spot. The toughest fight of my life. Patriarch doesn't sound like something an Asari would come up with. I found it humorous. He wanted power. And we pretended he had it with a word that doesn't exist for my people. <laughs> I eventually found a certain respect for the title and the man. Fair enough. Interesting. Well, let's move on. Do you need something else? Uh, no, not really. Thanks. Maybe I'll come back later. Maybe I'll you be here. find a nice young man to keep you warm in the meantime. Oh, you wow. look like you need to lose enough. Wow. Three thousand credits. Nothing to see here. Nothing to see here. You got anything for us? Well then, um, that actually very very neat brings us up to the uh what would what will be the end of our stream so sunday we only really stream for about four hours um come on let me in come on let me in wait what's up i heard a human went into the plague zone then i found out about a lot of dead vorcha down there you know anything about this who mean dead vorcha no don't know anything about that My job just got a whole lot easier. <laughs> I'll just be going. Keep up the good work. Hey. I ain't gonna I ain't gonna brag about killing things. I save that for the Twitch stream. The Normandy! I would try and get a good screenshot of the Normandy too. I like you can see the lights on it. Ah fuck it, let's try. Yeah. Problem is is this window type thing. But yeah, if we put the depth of field off, I, I like you can see the windows lit up. The council offered its sympathy, nice. but regretted that it could not become involved in a purely human matter. Uh, Normandy, shut up. Leave the Normandy. That's cool. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Cool. So let's we'll check our terminal for unread messages. Take care of Garrus. From now, Butler. Oh, my husband was one of the men serving Garrus's team. I don't know how much Garrus talked to you about what happened. Uh, I don't know the specifics myself. Only that my husband died in a trap by set by those bastard gangs. I know Garrus blames himself. He took every shot fired at his squad as a failure on his part. Uh, and it was clear when he it was clear when he sent me the message about my husband that he thinks it was his fault. My husband would never have wanted that. He was proud of the work he did on Garrus' squad. Uh, he was taking back Omega from the gangs. He died fighting with honor. I miss him. God, I'd give it anything to give him back. But whatever happened wasn't Garrus' fault. Here is Commander now. Please, if you can't help him to stop blaming himself. And please, don't tell him I sent you this. Thank you. Aww. Oh, hang on. Chief Medical Officer Chakwas. Uh, Commander, I've done some further investigation regarding your facial scarring. The old adage of mind over matter holds true. Negative attitudes and aggressive acts create adverse reactions with your cybernetic implants, while peaceful thoughts and compassionate actions promote healing. If you maintain a positive outlook, I believe your facial scarring will heal on its own. Otherwise, there is surgical equipment we could use. 
used to insulate your cybernetic implants and accelerate your human healing regardless of your mental outlook. Cool. Well, thank you very much, chat class. Okay, uh, right. So, ooh, new men bay upgrade, yeah. Um, so that is enough for uh, the Omega system and for Mass Effect today. So we are going to head away on a ready boy, boy. Uh, let us see who... Um, let's see who we're going to, to raid, raid, raid. Uh, we are going to raid a good friend of mine. Who I think has, uh, I think who's just finished the part, part that we're at. So let's go, uh, let's go for a wee raid on, uh, Ralik, who is playing Mass Effect 2. And we're at a very similar point in the story. Um, so yeah, we'll go for a wee raid from him. Uh, I will probably back, be back streaming on Tuesday exactly. What I'm streaming, uh, I, I'm not too sure yet. But Tuesday, 8 o'clock will be the next stream. But for just now, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. And I will see you on Tuesday. Bye! <laughs> we waited all... We waited all this fucking time. We waited all this fucking time for you to download the game. And you... Fucking get yourself banned! You my Are you fucking shitting me? <laughs> oh fuck! <laughs> God damn it, man. Hello! It's up down there, right behind you, behind you, up the stairs, there we go. No, that's my oh, tag! Oh! Oh, I got it, I got it, I fucking got it, it's there. Open the door, mippity boppity, fuck up some property. Oh fuck! I want, I want a pee pew because if I'm gonna encounter a cunt, I want to be able to clap him. Oh no, a cunt! <laughs> Ugh, I'm fucking penis! Oh my god, I was not ready for that cunt that just suddenly appeared. Jesus Christ! <laughs> Fuck's sake, budge! Please, please, please don't talk about somebody turning their back and blowing your way to somebody in the toilet. Yep. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Can we get some big stats in the chat? And then, uh, it doesn't really matter. <laughs> what the fuck? I did not crap you get so close! This is gonna be the weirdest sentence I say on stream. Contro <laughs> Control, this is Mrs. Miggins requesting a vehicle check on bro. Oh fuck. Okay. Oh uh, that something that I thought I saw something shiny. Down! Oh no 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 no! I don't wanna go down there! <clears throat> Fuck. Jeez! Yeah, I did it. <laughs> oh, no! Fuck! I should have fucking got that! No! You're a grenade. Ugh, fuck! Right, okay, yeah, you are a grenade. <laughs> They're executing up. <laughs> yeah, go in. <laughs> that was... That was, uh... He could have played Titan, bro. Sorry. Oh, no, he couldn't. No, he, no, he couldn't. We're, we're, we're we lose. Better. Are we the T's? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Medics have filled for my stuff. Motherfucker! Why did my body just fucking pop? <laughs> oh, that was amazing. Oh, fuck! I got taste! <laughs> if I did, I could see my goggles! <laughs> Get out. Right, okay, I've got Shavakadu. Because I assume the other medics have filtered my stuff. <laughs> Motherfucker! You wanna fucking. Oh lord! Woohoo! Be that, isn't it? I. 
rather not some random Counter Strike creatine. Ah! Fuck! And that guy's a creatine with a capital C, is all I'm saying. Go on! Oh, 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 yes! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking get it up, yeah! Uh, but yeah. Uh, that's literally how the boat moves. <laughs> <laughs> He's right, you know. <laughs> a big fire is literally how the boat moves. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's really well done. <laughs> uh, that that was shit. Woohoo!